Hello and welcome <laughs> to this finale episode of the RPG Exploration Society series. We are playing Avatar Legends, the RPG from Magpie Games. I am your illustrious GM, B. Zelda. I do some things, I show up places, but most importantly, I play games. So really quickly, we are going to go around so you can figure out who the heck these humans are that are sitting at this table. But what you won't learn is whether or not they are, in fact, humans. So let's start with... With Drac, how's it going today? <laughs> Hi, my name is Draconics or Drac for sure. I am not entirely sure if I'm human, so I guess that's pretty. I'm just gonna put that, make that questionable right out the gate. Um, you can find me on Twitter at Draconics. That's D R A K O N I Q E S. Kind of stream all over the place, playing a bunch of TTRPGs. But today I'm gonna be playing Azu, who is a, a very short, angry waterbender, uh, who, as far as he's aware, all want, really wants to just punch his dad in the face. So that's what's driving him right now. <laughs> <laughs> the power of punch. Well, <laughs> I think that delightfully leads us over to Vanna for literally no reason at all. Vanna, how's it going? <laughs> We're professionals. Truly. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I feel like you can't do that because Chad's going to be like, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> we just went live post Vanna having a complete meltdown. <laughs> uh, I just screamed a little. It was <laughs> a little scream a little. Scream. Yeah. <laughs> I, I rent a house I get to now. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. Heck yeah, houses are for screaming. I thought this was a safe space. <laughs> it is. When I also scream, I just get yeah, yelled at because it. other people are here and it's yeah. in the middle of the night. Um, okay. Yeah. Right. But <laughs> don't it. scream in your home place. <laughs> Do it. I'm, okay, I'm not going to scream no scrub. right now. Um, There's no scrub. One scrub, a small scrub. One, one small scrub. My mom wakes scrub. me to wake up early tomorrow to go to work. Um, and with COVID happening and being like a, a, a health worker, that she's already tired enough as is. I don't want to wake her up. Mm. Damn. Oh, you might have a mom, but your character Dang it, we doesn't. can't fight you. Oh, Connie! Connie! Oh, <laughs> Connie! Sorry, that was so out of the left field. It was great. <laughs> Okay, Why? that's me doing a little scrub. Um, yeah, that anyway, <laughs> I'm Vanna and I'm fine! <laughs> uh, and I'll be playing Coral, who is a earthbender, um, who is, you know, tough around the edges, but really just wants to love and be loved, you know? And that's that's it, you know? And maybe the only one that isn't going to punch her dad. <laughs> I well, Michelle probably won't. A punch. I probably won't touch. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that to our dad. Maybe I don't know. Maybe, <laughs> unless we triple dog dare each other too. <laughs> this is true. I'm not I was like, that. Trend, this is how you do it, okay? Just like slugs. <laughs> well, <laughs> slugs all our other siblings are punching our dad. I don't want to be left <laughs> out. Not out of that activity, no way. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> all Amazing. right. Well, to our second least punchiest, then Michelle. Hi, I'm Michelle Rapp. You can find me on Twitter at Kiln Fiend Potter, where I post many pictures of my cats, uh, nonsense about Magic the Gathering and TTRPGs, um, as well as, you know, lots of uh, fun takes on bread, because I bake a lot. I also do pottery, which is fun, which is why I killed Fiend. But anyway, uh, today I will be playing the ever sweet, um, a little too, I guess, gullible uh, mm -hmm. De Chen who is an air nomad um, and like the other, like everybody else on this stream except for me um, ha has the same father who uh, apparently just got really busy in his travels. So Dechen is not interested in particular in like punching her dad. She has no real qualms about it. She just wants to save him because I don't know, they're related. It's what you do because she's Aww. sweet. Also, she has a flying boar, a winged boar named Razorwing, who has 19 nipples. 19. Thank you very much, chat. <laughs> 19. That's a lot. Not an even number, but it's a good number. We don't ask about the last nipple. We don't talk about nipples. No, nipple, <laughs> nipple. We don't talk we about, about nipples. Nipple. 
yeah, I'm. Oh my god! <laughs> it was his wedding day. <laughs> it was wedding day. <laughs> you see the wedding day cloud in the sky. No, no clouds, clouds are loud in, in the, the sky. sky. <laughs> Tomatoes walking. <laughs> 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 wow, Are you growing the nipples yeah. or am I? <laughs> 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 That's what I'm like, Go on. <laughs> Just two razor wings. <laughs> two flying boars. <laughs> it's razor wing and his mom or something. <laughs> razor wing yeah. and his wife. This happened wow, on their wedding day. Yeah, oh, we, could yeah. Just, we could change it from wedding day to to my baptism. <laughs> <laughs> it was my bar mitzvah. It was my bar mitzvah day. <laughs> <laughs> this needs some writing. It needs a little bit more work. We, we, we should work on it. Yeah, we we'll, it. We'll bring it back next episode. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I was at the high end, and we was <laughs> not the high end. <laughs> I can see the The way I've been to like three bar mitzvahs at the Hyatt. <laughs> oh my god. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, all right. So, oh, Razor Wings hey. Quinceanera. Uh, yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Let's, I'm going to throw, it, of, I'm gonna throw it over to Connie. Connie, I'm going to throw it. Speaking of nipples. Out. I'm going to take it. <laughs> Speaking of nipples, I have new ones. Uh, hi, I'm Connie. I got top surgery. Yay! Yay. Uh, Ten days ago. Oh, yeah. Yay! I'm now flat, very, very flat. Uh, I'm Connie. My like Kansas, are they which we last time like Kansas, but that's an in joke <laughs> that none of the viewers will understand. No. Um, um, but I'm not here being Yali, uh, our very by the book intense firebender who would punch their dad i think not out of anger but out of a desire to know what it's like to punch a, a parent which they've never been allowed to do before uh so because of catharsis i feel like it's like a quadrant huh. uh ozzy <laughs> would punch out of anger yali would punch for catharsis dechen wouldn't punch and cora would punch if they felt peer pressure to, do that. <laughs> <laughs> to fit him to, to be loved to fit him. <laughs> so tag yourself uh yeah but i'm not here playing yali <laughs> Um, no punch, I punch, maybe punch. <laughs> How many and punch. And punch if their friends punch. Their friends uh, punch. <laughs> uh, I am the GM and executive producer for Trans Planar RPG, which is an all transgender, people of color led, 100% homebrew Dungeons and Dragons 5th edition live stream actual play campaign set in Andake, an original non colonial anti orientalist world. Uh, I love what we do. You should tune in Saturdays at 7 p.m. U.S. Central Time. That's 5 p.m. Pacific and 8 p.m. Eastern, or listen to our podcast, which has a backlog that we're catching up on. Actually, our next podcast episode tomorrow drops with B as a guest star that we recorded like a year ago. So if you love B, check out the Arc 2 interlude episode dropping on <laughs> wherever you pod your casts. Uh, yeah, I am by Connie Chong on Twitter, uh, TikTok, and on Ko-Fi, where you can toss a coin to your Connie at by Connie Chong, B-Y-C-O-N-N-I-C-H-A-N-G. With that, I'm going to pass the baton of nipples back to B. Uh, There's 19 of them. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'm just thinking about can you imagine what a horrible texture? Is the handle Ooh. covered in nipples? Is the whole baton <laughs> nipples? Is it like all in a row? Or are we seeing like, it's a sort of Sir Hill spires are, around? Are razor wings nipples razors? No, oh, no, 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 no. Because, because babies gotta use them, huh? Your baby. Yeah. Razor and wings got a be... baby? I mean, maybe eventually how, that's how you get it, when one razor wing and another razor wing fall in love, and they both have the compatible genitalia necessary to make the baby. <laughs> they and they but decide the to have baby. <laughs> we talking unique nipples. We talking your basic nipples. Are they your basic? I, don't know enough of, <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't know, know if razor wings nipples. nipples could ever be basic. Pepperoni because razor nipples. Wings. Mm. Are they I edible? Like, I think that's what that means. Oh my god! And you can eat edible. anything. Do not try answer. hard enough. <laughs> <laughs> all right so we have some sponsors and pre-show notes to get over um we are aiming to raise 150 dollars per episode and or 35 new subs hitting this each night allows us to continue to pay this amazing cast and keep content like this up in the air or just on the air or around the air uh even if you can't afford to back us uh spreading the 
were and sharing the stream with friends, families, and anybody with or without nipples would be the kindest thing you could do. A tip of just $15 will allow you to send us a message, which we will read live on air. Uh, the fastest way for us to grow is for you to subscribe. No nipples necessary, so thank you. Oh, God. Uh, speaking of ways to support the stream and our sponsors, thank you so much to our season sponsor, Hero Forge, for supporting us. Uh, type exclamation point Hero Forge in chat to check out the wonderful customization tool they've created and to get your very own personalized miniature now with full color options today. It's seriously very, very, very awesome. There are like color versions of our our characters minis available on twitter it's actually very very cool so check it out go to saving throw show twitter.com to check out those minis and i'm gonna pass things along to jirak really quickly so, for y'all who made mini uh the the figure the figures in hero forge yeah did they have nipples no no, no they actually didn't no they have nipples or genitalia yeah they huh. they have underwear on Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, okay. They're they're never nudes. All of our minis and, are never nudes. And if they're shirtless, they're nippless. Nippless. <laughs> I think it also but depends nippless. on I mean like there are just some there are some species on there that just don't have nipples, like bird people and sink people. That's Reptiles. Have nipples. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Usually no. under the feds and stuff, right? Wait, I don't know. No, no, birds should not have Why do they get birds are not yeah. mammals? Yeah. Birds are yeah, their own they're not mammals. Yeah, they're not you, mammals. Yeah. Can you imagine birds are, are they? like they're not mammals, they're definitely their they're own not, yeah. kingdom. Mammals, they're just birds. Mammals, like yeah. they're their own thing. Have like um give live births is one of the yeah, mammals criteria of a mammal and birth. have memory gland. A memory okay, gland but a platypus has a beak Except and platypus. has nipples. They're platypus are weird. They have Platypi are just poisonous. freaks of nature. They, well, but, they, they, but they also have milk patches instead of nipples, so they do produce milk. Ew! Patches? But they sweat it out. <laughs> they sweat it out. Like a, like a good Pilates workout. Anyway, oh. thank you for coming to our TTRPG. Oh. I'm sure you're expecting hours of last dinner, but right here we're here for weird platypus facts and nipples. Yeah. Sorry yeah. about that. We we weird these facts into the sponsorship talk. But anyway, talk about another partnership that we have. <laughs> we also have a partnership with Die Hard Dice. Um, if you, you can save ten percent off on any Die Hard Dice purchase by using our saving our code uh, saving throw twenty twenty. 2022, no, save and throw 22 at checkout. Um, you can put command exclamation point DHD in chat and it should pop up with all the links you need and the details of the code. Um, and yeah, you can buy you can buy a bunch of dice. I, I think all of my dice are diehard dice. Um, so I can yeah. definitely say from using them a lot, uh, highly recommend. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm gonna throw it over to uh, Michelle. Well, thank you so much, Jack. Over here in YouTube land, I first want to say thank you so much to those people who are watching us on YouTube. Um, and do us a solid. If you have a moment, just leave us a like, comment, maybe subscribe, smash that bell, the whole nine yards. It really helps the show and the channel as a whole. And now you can go back to like washing dishes or whatever you were doing. <laughs> Last bit of all, the least. Don't Anna. watch the rest of the show. <laughs> I mean, you can listen to the rest of the show. Yeah, let's you just get to subscribe. A lot of people away. watch us. Watch Have us. Have you seen us? <laughs> We're amazing. We are watch all the fun. show. <laughs> but if you're like, also, I need to do dishes while I'm doing this, you know, more power to you. Mm -hmm. That's all I gotta say. Mm -hmm. Just don't back Spe me while you're watching. Speaking of show. power, Vanna. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What the fuck does that mean? Because <laughs> you're Anna, powerful. You're, what you're do you mean? You're power. <laughs> you're power. POP. A POP. I was gonna say. You're a POP. POP. A person. Yep. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we should start calling white people <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> that's what i thought was happening <laughs> i didn't connect that I didn't... <laughs> oh dear you're a person of privilege <laughs> yeah oh, yeah no. yeah i didn't think about yeah. that but i really like it and i'm gonna use it from now on wow i'm gonna use that from now on <laughs> Listen, Only here. I'm happy you to be the, the beginning. I'm happy to be the test subject <laughs> for this terminology. We thank you for your sacrifice. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> lastly, my face hurts already. Um, <laughs> lastly, support the channel through tips. Or else. <laughs> that's it. That was the whole thing. Tips. That was, that's, I understand. Just glare, the power everybody thing just glare at the now. camera. 
Um, and monthly subscriptions via our Ko-Fi. Exclamation point Ko-Fi in the chat. That's a K and an O and an F and an I. Uh, check it out. On Ko-Fi, you can tip as you would regularly here uh, on the Twitch. But you can also join the Exploration Society with a monthly amount. You get the same great rewards as Patreon, and you can unlock some things like toast with your tips. Plus, Ko-Fi doesn't take a cut, so nearly 100% of your tips goes straight to the channel. Uh, you know, other than PayPal fees, but we have we can't do anything about that. We're a part of a system that that will nickel and dime us until we're in our graves. So we live in a society, so please pay us. <laughs> Don't worry about that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Before we jump into the recap, we have a couple of toasts. Um, yeah. I can go ahead and read the first one from the delightful Papa Brain Boiler. All right. Listen up, kids. I have some information here that could be very useful. I figured out where the Fire Lord keeps his armies. They're up his sleeves. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sleeves. How big sleeves. are these sleeves? Are they like his shoulder pads? Oh, oh, immense. I love Girthy. the big sleeve. Don't. Mm. Mm. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> Connie, Wait a second. Mute your mic. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, who would like to read wow. our second toast? I'll read it. Good, um, go from track, go. Modern Chow, also known as Mo Oh, Chow. do it in a British accent. That'd be fun. Isn't can that what do I'm doing it? now? Wait. <laughs> can, you, can you do it like doing? a Cockney? Or, I cannot or like do a Cockney a, accent. Okay, can you do can a you Scottish accent? <laughs> Wait, what? Scottish? <laughs> you know, it's a Cockney accent? No. Um, promiscuous Papa Saga finale hype. Is that was pretty one. good. It's a pretty good Cockney accent. Thank oh, yeah. you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wow! Like, oh god! Like, am I not doing that right now? Did I slip into another accent? <laughs> what that was the joke. <laughs> I I saw okay, some name how people are talking. No so one I was like, understands actually... my genius. <laughs> Your IQ is just too high. <laughs> genius is an adjective. It's not always the right one, Vanna, but it is an adjective. All right. I don't even know. It's not an adjective. I'm not no, smart enough to decipher like what you said, but I think it was mean. <laughs> oh, I is definitely a, a noun. I think like it's a, a noun. Yeah. Maybe it's both. Your your shoes are looking very geniusy today. <laughs> yeah. Or or he's he's a genius yeah. comedian. Does that work? Yeah. Like genius can be used as um an adjective as well um just a second i'm so. gonna have to look this up yes it can i'm currently I'm also genius. the dictionary is not prescriptive it is descriptive so it is, could be whatever i'm we just, want. just we're just enough. getting people use genius as an adjective that it's an adjective oh i see i see i see i see dictionary I'm, suggests that it's both a noun and an adjective what else is it it is also <laughs> what else, what else? <laughs> I don't. Do you want me to just read? You, you know what? You know what it isn't. It's not nipples. So we're gonna with that circling back. Let's... You're right. You're so right. Speaking so of nipples, sorry. we're saving Last our dad. Time. <laughs> yes. Last time on Avatar Legends, the RPG, the siblings are reunited. Coral was able to escape the tank where her and Bagel, the cabbage seller, were being transported as prisoners. The three siblings, Azu, Dechen, and Yali, worked together to halt the prisoner transport and face off against General Typhlosion. With luck on their side, they escaped with alacrity. And with the 19th... Oh god, and the 19 nippled razor wing. They headed towards the royal palace. There, another sibling awaited them. With a raucous sneeze, flame erupts from his nostrils. And that's where we left off. He has no nose hair. Right. <laughs> he has is gone. Or they're it's really resilient. Yeah. They're, they're really <laughs> hanging in there. That's a thing. Science. Oh gosh. All right. So, um, to kind of reestablish the scene, I believe you were somewhere behind the royal palace. Palace, and the royal palace is like this immense building. Um, I personally kind of forgot what it looks like on the outside from Avatar, but I'm picturing um, 
lots of spires, lots of height, lots of red, lots of brick. Um, nothing too ornate. It's more functional than it is fashion. And uh, the back of this palace, in my brain, it is the exact, um, in the Ocarina of Time, one of the first missions you have to do when you leave Kok uh, Kokiri Forest is you go to Hyrule and you have to kind of like sneak in the back of Hyrule Castle to go visit Princess Zelda. And you go behind, you push like this crate, and then you have to kind of like get on all fours to crawl through this ch only child fitting hole in the ground where you kind of come come out um and then there's guards everywhere uh spoilers spoilers for this game 20 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and also the very beginning like you are still a child um so i'm, I'm i want to kind of reimagine this cobblestone setting with uh that little square that only children can crawl through as this young boy stands in front of it wearing the regalia of um somebody of the fire nation modestly sized pauldrons the shoulders aren't doing anything special the tassels aren't glinting or catching the light in any way um this kid has mm, we'll say like some suntanned skin giant giant eyes um that sparkle green with flecks of gold and just a mess of black hair that has probably never been washed brushed or ever shaved and the kid stares at you while sniffling uh what what do you want again i i take out the picture of our father <laughs> and I look at and I look at this kid and I look at this picture. I'm like, I, I turn to I turn to um, my my siblings and I say, I I think this is another sibling. Are you meant to rush them? I don't know if we want to. We want to be seen here. They're clearly in some kind of Fire Nation regalia. We're trying to break into the fire palace. Should like I knock him out? I can knock him out. So is Yali. <laughs> yeah, but I know Yali's got muted. got back. <laughs> No, 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 no. I was just, I was just reacting oh. to what everyone was doing. <laughs> was it trying to say? Honestly, you can't just headbutt everyone. You need to save your I've headbutted headbutts. everyone so far and it's actually worked, actually. You haven't like, headbutted me. Do you want me to? No. I mean, okay. Don't I don't know if now's me. the time for that. Hey, hey uh, kid. Do you know who your dad is? Oh, whoa. Do you oh. know who your dad is? <laughs> who is your father? <laughs> what, Coral? That's uh, a good line of questioning to start. If he's one of it's us. It's just really forward. <laughs> I know, but we don't have any time to waste. Who knows how many children of our father and other kids might be down there in the Fire Lord's secret prison well, he's about to be trapped. broiled. He's chilling. Yeah, I'm chilling. Well, he might. I who? Oh. Okay, what? I'm chilling. You know, I give this kid a handkerchief. Clearly needs one. Oh, thank you. Uh, there was a lot of lot of snot. I can't help it. Yes, sometimes. a lot of snot. You might yeah. want to clean up. Here. I'm allergic to. I don't really know. Um, sorry, flame shoot out of my nose. It's kind of my thing. Um, so I see uh, snot coming towards us. I knock it away with some wind. Oh God. That's <laughs> <laughs> disgusting. Uh, so I can answer like most of your questions. Um, uh, I, I know who my father is. He's inside. Uh, apparently he's somebody really important. I just met him a week ago. Uh, kind of cool. Not really as, like, a fatherly as I thought. Does he look like this? <laughs> Does he? Um, <laughs> it's been uh, really hard. It, it's easier to see when you actually when it's Yeah, hold it farther screen. back to Chen. Oh! Okay, <laughs> uh, Kinda, yeah, yeah. I mean, he's kind of, he's kind of unique. Fluke. The yeah, I've like taped it back together because I think one of you actually punched it. Yeah. I think Azu punched it. Oh yeah, it. I punched yeah. it. Yeah. 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 Daddy uh, issues. <laughs> what are you doing up here? Do you work for the Fire Nation, or are you trying to infiltrate? Uh, well. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm here for a reason. I, apparently, I'm waiting for some kids that are supposed to come here that are gonna That's us. Info Where are the kids? Uh, wait, hold on, Yali. Let's let him Yali, finish. Yali, yeah. <laughs> if we might... wait for him to finish, 
the hundred year war is gonna pass are we in the war yet <laughs> we're in it has it happened yet it's like year one <laughs> okay this if we wait for him to finish really, the war will be over war we're going in a hundred <laughs> 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 Why are you calling it a hundred war? Year, year just war? an it's assumption based based on how <laughs> based on bureaucracy works. Bureaucracy. Well, yeah, you know I know a lot more about bureaucracy than us. I guess. Yeah, that's uh, that's true. Let's assume that. Oh, yeah, since you also like told me I was gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't want to talk really. about that. Was, we don't know feelings. that. <laughs> we think that their channel is going to be entirely fan and so would the rest of their, their uh, yeah we leave like we go live in a tree we live in a really they found big a different tree planet. No a completely <laughs> different portal. planet yeah if anyone was going to be aliens it's the fucking airbenders you all know it <laughs> seriously <laughs> uh so we escaped to san francisco 1967 <laughs> is this a reference story. to something oh no summer of love anyway go ahead hippies go ahead <laughs> oh, oh okay okay <laughs> um uh so no my job uh i was supposed to bring some kids in <laughs> and uh and then well and then i was gonna get taught a really cool technique uh wait hold, I, hold who on. assigned uh, you this job yeah uh well i never really saw his face uh tall uh medium-sized shoulders uh often wore a mask but the mask was made out of like gold and red it was really pretty uh let's do uh, okay good. i airbend it <laughs> just... <laughs> uh i don't know you know i just kind of got brought here a little while ago uh i was rounded up this sounds like a trap to me if i'm this does tiny, sound like honest. a trap Azu. well, we well i hope those kids show this. up and slap them <laughs> <on> the shoulder <laughs> We'll be hey. going now. <laughs> um, okay. We should take him with us because he's gonna die. If, if why is he gonna die? Thing. Because we're gonna te try to teach him the thing. Oh the yeah, thing I don't know if we thing. told you this, Coral. Um, we found out that other kids, uh, basically our other half siblings, all got cap. Most of them got captured by the Fire Nation, and then tried. They tried to make them learn the brain melting thing, and they died. But it in killed the them. Yeah, it killed them. Yes, we yes. yes. take him with us because I don't want another sibling getting killed. Or maybe we could just scare him off. You're good at that, right, Azu? Scare him off. Yeah, Azu, you're scary. Just go scare, scare him. him off. I usually just beat Here, them up. To... I'm not I good at doing loan that. You... I can loan you Razor Wing. Like, you both can be okay. scary. Okay. Okay, Mr. I've never Mako. tried doing intimidation. I usually just try and beat them until, until they fall unconscious, and that go. usually does <clears> the job. <throat> Something tells me that this fucker is very impressionable. So I think if we just offer something nice, he'll come with us. Okay. Yeah. Like I a think tissue, you... maybe? No, like <laughs> oh, if some Mucinex. Bless you. <laughs> if they're you. promising him to learn a new technique, let's promise to teach him two new techniques if he helps us. Or we can take him on a ride on Razor Wing. No one Why don't resist? we offer all three options? Okay, but one, one at a time because for. then we can right. escalate. Yeah. It's yeah. called yeah. the and, and on the Azu option. Okay. And the then, first one is So it's like we have a carrot and then Azu is the stick. Exactly. Well, that's not how that works. I can be a stick. <laughs> Do you hit your donkeys with sticks? Wait, we're talking about donkey. I thought we were talking about hitting this guy with a stick. Well, carrot on a stick. Yali pi like pivots the to the kid. <laughs> <laughs> Yali pivots to the kid and says, listen, kid. Just over here uh, picking his nose. You it, stop doing that. Stop. Do you, uh, <laughs> if we offered you a ride on a flying winged pig, would you leave this place? Dead it was like the, the most ass. awesome ride you've ever had. A beautiful boar. Whoa, how many nipples does that thing got? <laughs> 19. At least 19. Oh my god, <laughs> that's really cool. Um, but no, I just met my, met my dad a week ago and the. The fire people say if I'm good, I could learn a really cool secret technique and that I could be used for war. Well, be used for war. what if Coral taught you two super secret techniques? Would you leave who's if Coral? Coral taught you two? Who's this who's Coral? Right, right here. Oh. This. <laughs> this. Oh. Uh. I also pull like a little, a little cake out of my bag. <laughs> 
What does this cake look like? Oh, it looks Boogers? like one of those like no. <laughs> That's why you that want. The <laughs> it looks like something out of a patisserie. Like it's got like a sponge cake, like a fruit creme pa like a jam and then some creme pat and then another thing of sponge and then on top it's got like um a, some more like whipped cream and then like a little like and then it's got like a, a mango gelé mm -hmm. and then like a little ras some raspberries and then like a little little sprig of mint oh my gosh <laughs> that's beautiful uh uh and also the timeless wisdom of my family what are your family but, dead? Are they spirits? Whoa. No, but we do have timeless uh, wisdom. I, I just I just want to, like, I want power. I, I mostly want to beat up my bullies, but, you know, power is cool. Cora, hey, I could train cake? you. I could train you to fight. Okay, see, you look cool. That oh. co Coral? Uh, <laughs> I don't, I, I don't want to know what, what they know. Wait, hold on. What does that mean? Wait, what? Hold on a second. I appreciate you uh, complimenting what? me. That was nice, and I, oh, honestly, I think okay. I needed the affirmation. You don't have to compliment like... somebody by putting someone else down. Yeah, that was un that was kind of unnecessary. Yeah, that's Wait, like, that's our sibling. You do you don't do no that. no yeah. How do compliments work then? <laughs> well, if you come with us, we can tell you. <laughs> okay, see now I'm interested. <laughs> now you got my attention. <laughs> What the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> I can someone I make a plead roll for me? A food roll? A plead. Oh. Um, is that with harmony? It is with harmony. I have a minus one to that. Not me. I have a <laughs> two to harmony. I have one. Yeah. I have a zero. Detchen, That's me. <laughs> I, I'm standing here with this cake, looking oh, real. I have a minus two actually. I really is, I have way too many conditions. Oh fuck. So um. <laughs> Okay. Uh, let me see. Um uh let's see. Can I get help with this? I am being helped, yes. Is this how this works? Um, I, I think you can roll weeks. first uh okay. and we can yeah. lend help if it can bump it up by one. Sure. Okay, that <laughs> Okay, that's an eight, which is great. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so to the nine, they need something more evidence that this is the right course, guidance in making the right choice, or resources to aid them before they act. Now that feels right. Um, so the young boy, who looks a little bit younger than the four of you, that tousled hair and clothing that, well, it looks kind of cool and like freshly pressed, does not fit very well. Um, and the kid kind of digs for gold in his nose for a few more seconds. Uh... Okay, so hold on. I gotta run it through my head again. Compliments. You don't you don't put people down for a compliment. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I I want to <clears throat> join you, but I also don't want to disappoint my new dad. However, he's really just promising me like uh how to be cool and how to make friends. Wait, so, I hold on a hold on a second. Um uh -huh. Your new dad, your dad, uh -huh. the person you just met, uh -huh. asked you to find some kids. Uh -huh. I hope you find them, by the way. I hope you do. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll keep looking. And where is he? Is he, he's not, is he in a cell? Uh, sometimes he's in a cell. Sometimes we hang out and have tea in the cell. Uh, he's terrible at drinking tea. It's kind of weird to watch. Wait, wait, uh, is your new dad the same guy as the masked guy? No, I was hoping so at first, but then it was like, no, Max guy, you're just kind of mead. And then dad, uh -huh. well, he's taking orders from Max guy. I know there's a lot to take in. Believe you me, I've just been here a week. I'm barely old enough to do any of this. That's why I keep blowing fire under my, my, achoo, my nose. You, you uh, probably need to get like checked to see what exactly you're allergic to. It might be what you're wearing. I know some people are allergic to like wool and stuff like that. Um, well, I look really cool. I've never worn anything that's nice. Okay. So that much is uh, evident. Can can everybody teach me one new spell? <laughs> well, what am spell. I saying? <laughs> spell. What is this? Dungeons and Dragons. Hey, do you, do you play can, teach RPGs? We that's, can that's all really cool teach you <laughs> a valuable lesson. That is something we can all do, and I can okay. certainly promise that. 
I would like one valuable lesson from everyone. What are your names, by the way? Did I tell you my name? No. No. Why don't we just walk Booger? this no, way? That's what they call me go. back home. You, you can talk to us as we, as we make, become Let's familiar. walk and talk. And maybe you can find these <laughs> kids you're looking for along the way. Let, let's yeah. go. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Good. Yeah. good, good, good. And uh, yeah, Booger starts to walk along with the four Oh, their name is Booger? <laughs> <laughs> canon now the poor kid never got a chance oh my god <laughs> <laughs> while ozzy's walking they're gonna wish whisper to the chan and be like we're, we're taking him to like somewhere dark so we can beat him up right that's this is, is that's kind of like the vibe i was getting that's what i usually do back home like i'm just getting the same vibe from this i just want to make azu, sure we're on the same page azu, azu you should eat this cake okay here you go Okay, I'm gonna, let's go. Gonna eat yeah. cake. <laughs> it's just beating up a side. Azu has a point. We can't take him where our dad is because he's gonna complete his mission and oh no, try to boil I was a just brain going in. to. I was just gonna lead him. I was just gonna lead him down like an alley, and then we can like get more information, and then like. Just not him there. Know. It's our brother. Because like, this is our brother, obviously. Like we can't. Can't bring him back. Can't mug our own brother in an alley. No, we're, we're I'm not, not gonna, gonna take mug. anything. We're not gonna mug him. We just need to get out of we're not, sight. We, we're just gonna it's eat him. It's called assault. Okay, uh, if it's mugging when you take something from them after the. Okay, I know how this works. You sure whisper a lot, all of you. <laughs> I yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, okay. thank you. I could whisper too. Yeah, just prove it. <laughs> I will. <laughs> okay, Booger, this is the valuable life lesson I'm going to teach you. And Yali oh. stops right at like the mouth of an alley and turns. Uh, and they reach forward and they snatch the pauldrons off. And they like oh. very quickly begin to tailor like their clothing to fit their frame. <laughs> oh. uh, because Yali, I mean, actually knows how to dress in Fire Nation like regalia. And just. Yeah. And like when Yali's done with them, like. He like they step back and he actually looks like well dressed, right? Like with pins and like little sewing bits oh done in. <gasps> Detcha claps, claps in appreciation and delight. A good Nobody's suit goes a long way. Uh, yeah, it does. I feel like I could walk in the front doors of the royal palace now, and I wouldn't be kicked out. Wait, hold on. You couldn't walk through the front. That just seems kind of unfair. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm not I'm not well received. That's why I have to go I have to crawl through the back door. I'm not even allowed in like a door that opens. It sounds like the Fire Lord hierarchies to everything. <laughs> All well, right. I feel good now. Uh what what are we doing? I have to go look for some kids. Okay, Wait, uh, uh, it's my turn. Uh, <laughs> hi, Hookers. Now I'm glad I'm glad that you feel really wonderful on the outside. Now let's focus on the inside. I'm going to teach okay. you how to center yourself so that when you're nervous, you uh -huh. can do this and you feel more calm. So just close your eyes and breathe in <sighs> and breathe out. <sighs> I have allergies, so it's hard to breathe. I know. Just, just do it through your mouth. I know it's a little weird. <sighs> Eventually, maybe you can do it through your nose. Out. Um, can I do a really quick... Uh, earth bending because my yeah. specialty is like fine metal bending. Can I make him like um and just fly it over and maybe he doesn't notice it? it like it's one of when people have sleep apnea, sometimes they put things at their nose that like spread their nostrils apart while they sleep. Oh, oh yeah, God. yeah. Can I make like a quick septum <laughs> ring to help him? It looks with, really cool, but bending? really it's a breathing device, right? Yeah, oh my god, yeah. Yeah, um, let's rely on your skills and training. Because, oh you know, you God. totally know how to do that. This kid's gonna, like, Sorry, walk out looking badass. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, you don't want to accidentally lobotomize him. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind brain boiling. I want to help in any way I can. Um, I would like to help with this role. Do I have to roll? Uh, yeah, give me mm -hmm. a roll with, uh, 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 I forgot how this game works. Let's focus. Oh no. Are oh, they gonna die? Okay. <laughs> I'm teaching you how to breathe out of nowhere. Some metals gets uh, Eight. Eight. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Make success. So you do it imperfectly. Um, so a couple things can happen here. We can, there can be a consequence, or you can mark a fatigue to have this work as flawlessly as possible. Consequence. Oh, right. 
Um, so first off, describe what he's it looks bleeding. like. <laughs> That's why he's, he's gonna get the worst nosebleed of his life. <laughs> but can he breathe? Yes. Yeah. Great. It just burns a little. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, I we I take out like some I take out just some like tissues and I just okay, hold your head, tilt your head back, tilt oh, your head back. I was the fire back. coming from is... my nose, not blood. Oh, it tastes so bad. I know. Oh. Just, just, just don't eat just it. Gonna, just gonna tilt your head <laughs> back. I wipe his face, and in the process, I like take some like moist towels and just like clean his <laughs> face, <laughs> oh, and child. then adjust it. And like, all right, that was the wisdom that I oh. imparted. And I see Coral imparted some wisdom of of her own as well. I'm just trying to help with the breathing because it seems difficult. Is, breathing huh. is excellent with wisdom. Thank you. So now. so breathe in through your nose and out. Oh. Okay, well that's awkward. Okay. You're good. Oh, something shifted in there. Oh, weird. Okay. Oh, <laughs> it's a bit of brain matter. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> oh god. <laughs> and then I, I look at Azu and I'm like, it's your turn. <laughs> I'm teaching them my, I'm like teaching them my thing. Like I'm teaching them a lesson, right? Okay. Um it hey, has to be kids, a, an um, honorable lesson. Uh-huh. Yes. Honorable? So I don't know. I don't know if this is <laughs> I don't really know what honor is. That. Um so in a fight, always uh -huh. expect the unexpected, okay? Oh no. So I'm gonna train you. Here you go. So I'm gonna throw a right hook and I'm going to block it, okay? Hold on, right, left, right hook. Okay. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna punch in three, two, I'm just gonna headbutt him. <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> Um, Booger screams and his forehead starts to bleed. <laughs> I told you to expect the unexpected. I told you I'm going to punch wipe you. Off the blood, I'm punch I wipe you. off the blood and I can't, I think I can heal him. That's not really how this works. So I just, I just wipe up. the blood. <laughs> I wipe the blood. I take out a cupcake and I give it to him and I say, well, those are the lessons that we had to impart. <laughs> um, <laughs> congratulations. You are now... So much wiser. Oh. Incredible. Okay. I think I think I have a headache. That's called a concussion. Don't don't sleep should, at least another oh. four or five sit hours. Sit down. You need to sit down. I could feel my pulse in my eyeballs. Yeah, that happens. Huh. You drink this tea? Well, sit where did down. that come from? Okay. Where did that uh, come from? <laughs> <laughs> I just have a I just I just have this this pouch and it's just what I've been pulling and no one's told me no yet. So I'm <laughs> yeah. going. And it's always hot. <laughs> I don't know if it's always hot. I think it's like a jug get, of it's like a jug of tea. Some cold ass tea. Cold tea. Some yeah. cold tea. It's like yeah. cold brew tea. That's nice. Uh, so I, I heat it up with my hands, my molten hands. Oh, that's there we nice. go. Uh, teamwork. What's the best teamwork? The it also melts the flask or whatever. Yeah, I do it too, too fast and it cracks the flask. I just pour the tea out and then I just put the onto my hands. It it evaporates. No, no, I just steam. I just pour it into like a cup, a separate cup, as much as I can. And then I'm like, does anyone want to drink this before it falls apart? Uh, yeah, I'll drink it. I'm not feeling too great, honestly. Okay, great. Uh, my yeah, eyeballs are also throbbing, and I'm gonna start drinking. And then, oh. and then we just we lower boogers to the ground and then <laughs> lie down. He's like, uh, just okay. lie here. Just close definitely your don't eyes. sleep. Don't sleep. Oh, uh, don't, oh, yeah, don't no. sleep. Don't oh. sleep. Okay, okay. Just stay here and don't go anywhere. Don't go back into the palace. You understand? Are we taking razor weight? I ask okay. quietly. That's not subtle. I don't if know you if... bring a fucking 500 pound boar into the palace. Okay, in that case, you stay. I turn to Razor Wing and I say, Hey, buddy, you're going to stay out here, okay? And take care of our new friend. Make sure he doesn't <laughs> fall asleep. <laughs> what? Fan? <laughs> <laughs> I'm role playing Razor Wing. <laughs> Thank you. Perfect. Thank Hello. you. Hold on. <laughs> I, that's exactly how my pig sounds. Yes. Just make sure he doesn't fall asleep, okay? Okay. You're such a good boy. This is my good boy. <laughs> hey, I think we should go see that kid size hole that. Uh, oh my god! I bet razor razor wings really boogery too, so they'll probably get along. Yeah, they're both really snotty. <laughs> razor ring was slobbery. 
He's slobber. Are, yes. What are, yes, it's true. What are boogers but the slobber of the nose, you know? No. <laughs> you know I'm right, B. I hate it. You know I'm right. Y- Yali is at oh. the hole. Yeah. yeah. I followed I followed you. I followed you. I've I've hugged my farewell to my precious precious boar. And I followed you. Remember because what I taught you. Always expect the unexpected. And then I'm gonna go and follow, join the rest of them. Okay. <laughs> See, you did it. Uh-huh. Hey, what does <laughs> what does my boar do to keep him? <laughs> Just lays oh, on top of him. <laughs> most likely, lays on top of the kid's legs so the kid can't move. But it's also like the legs are just uncomfortable enough that he can't fall asleep either. And every now and then, when they start falling asleep, he just goes. <laughs> like, oh my god! What is that noise? <laughs> I don't know. I wasn't that? you, Vanna. Vanna, you yeah. make the noise. Make, make it like an oink noise. <laughs> it changes every time. There's two animals. He just one. yells. Why is the clothes yells trying to be a voice a actor? They're just trying to be a voice Truly. actor. They have different sounds that they're practicing. Is really... He's actually a singer. So every time he starts to fall asleep, he wakes him up with some sort of loud pop song. Pop <laughs> song. The most we walk away from the, the alley. Thing. We hear like Billie Eilish. <laughs> I was literally just thinking Billie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the bad pig. The four of us just walk away with this happening. <laughs> and yeah, I guess we start. We head towards the hole. Yeah, we head um, to the hole. <laughs> The weird little crawl space that only a child could fit through. Are the four of you going to crawl through? Are we? I'm going to go first because I feel like I'm the smallest out of everyone. Is it Do a not... wall? Yeah. So it's going to take you inside of the royal palace and it's like um, eight inches of no. eight inches, eight feet of brick. Hi. I'm gonna, can I air bend Five feet. up really quickly? Like do a jump to see like if there's yeah. anything on the other side before we go through? Because I don't yeah. want to just like go through and then we're like in a net. Oh, <laughs> That's a good point. Cool. Okay. Uh, what do I roll uh, for that? Either reliance skills or training or assess the situation. Okay. Uh, That's creativity if you want to assess the situation. I'm going to go ahead and assess the situation. Okay. That is also an eight. We All right. Sweet light. Yeah. <laughs> One question. Uh, what here can I use to blank? Who or what is the biggest threat? What should I be on the lookout for? What's my best way in, out, or through? Or who or what is in the greatest danger? What am I looking out for? It seems to be the correct, I think the right one. Full yeah. Story. Yeah. Uh, so like you are on the lookout for danger. This is the Royal Palace. The, it is teeming with Fire Nation soldiers. And based off what Bagel told you, also I don't know where Bagel went. Um, <laughs> this where there was a dude. <laughs> just, he's like hiding in Razor Wing somehow. Found <laughs> <Just, just, just laughs> a really comfy spot near the belly. He's suckling, <laughs> yeah. Oh no! Oh, ah! No! <laughs> no! Not Don't as only that 18 visible thing. nipples. So, <laughs> so it's oh, even now. It's even... Oh dear. So what am I looking at? Uh, 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 so uh, as, as you kind of leap overhead, um, this wall, uh, say it's about five feet thick of just pure red brick. And on the other side is a roof. Um, it goes down a little bit. So you're unable to see on the inside, but there are a couple, let's say maybe three or four soldiers that are patrolling the roof. Um, they've got halberds in their arm, the uh, helmets over their face, so they're looking pretty lethargic. Any, so no fiddlers. No fiddlers. On no, the no flutes no. or fiddlers. Oh, I was like, what the fuck kind of question is that? <laughs> <laughs> I just saw his face now. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> In our little oh. town of Edithopia. That's right. <laughs> Sunrise, sunset. That's Razor Wing singing right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Razor Wing is like sunset. <laughs> it's just doing Barbara Streisand <laughs> Again, I don't understand his range. It's, it's, gonna be a star. it's really impressive, though. It's really impressive. <laughs> I think he's wasting a lot of potential just to be in our vehicle at this point. I honestly uh-huh. feel bad. I feel like we're holding him back. Uh-huh. You know, I did ask him this question a while back, but he says he's happiest this way. And, you know. Okay, yeah. As long as he has um, a toy. Uh, yeah. Do you so think he's going to attract any attention doing that? <laughs> 
We come back, there's Not like people happy. gathered, there's like money on the ground. It's panic. Bring them on. <laughs> <laughs> or with that many nipples, is he? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it could be a good one. <laughs> so, All right, back All right. at the child shaped hole in the wall. I'm already Quit quoting calling it that, please. <laughs> I know. I hate I, it. This hole is, is just for me. Um, so <laughs> no. <laughs> I've read that original D and D adventure. <laughs> I I float back down and I uh, before Azu crawls in, I I grab his shoulder and say, oh. "All right, the coast is clear. Just to be clear, there are some cool people on the roof, so just be careful." Okay, cool, cool, cool. I think let's do this. We got this, and I'm just gonna start crawling through the hole um i poke azu's butthole <laughs> what i <laughs> why that's what I... siblings do right they prank each other <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Um... maybe like not right now <laughs> oh, no. i'm just trying to make up for last time <laughs> coral if you coral. do that to me you're gonna be missing a digit well <laughs> you could do it to me <laughs> no thank you also, do you think you could earthbend the hole wider so we can get through too? Azu's yeah. a little... Sorry, Azu, you're kind of smaller than the rest of us. I think if I do that, I'm going to shift the rest of the wall, and that might be kind of obvious. Right? By the way, I'm not small. I am perfectly average height. Mm. You're fun size. Mm. Let's just see no. if you fit, and if not, I'll push you. Not small and average. I <laughs> keep crawling, <laughs> crawling through. All right, as we was made it through this space, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try to get through. Perfect. Army crawl. <laughs> yeah, um, it's uncomfortable. It's pressing against your shoulders. Um, you felt like if you had any exposed skin, you would get like, um, what is it called? Like when you like scrape your arms on the dirt. Rug burn. Scrape. Actually, actually, before we scrape. go in, I asked yeah. Coral, maybe you could like instead of moving the wall, Poke your butt. You could just you could just make the the trench <laughs> like the ground underneath like deeper. Oh so yeah, you could, I could like, do that. Ooh, down. Yeah, yeah. That's smart. What's weird thing? I'm taking a scoop. <laughs> Scoopy scoop. Oh, so. With that, I do manage to go through and hopefully not get my butt poked. <laughs> yeah, so Yali looks at Coral little... and goes, you next. Listen, <laughs> I... <laughs> Fine. <laughs> and Coral crawls under. <sighs> Yali, like, takes a beat as they're the only one <laughs> remaining on the other side of the wall. And, like, the intrusive thought comes in of, like, just... What if I just them. left? <laughs> just, just leave them. <laughs> But you, Yelly entertains it for a second, but then goes through the hole. Perfect. On the other side is pitch darkness. There is the distant sound of people screaming, metal clanging, the roaring of flames, and just the smell of decay. It's putrid, it's moist, it's dark, and it's dank, but not the good kind. Um... <laughs> It's not full of weed. Zero <laughs> percent. <laughs> Dank has other. Symptoms. If we can, Both if we can these. sense that dankness, maybe it'll lead us to our father. <laughs> dude, that's fair. That dude definitely smokes. <laughs> okay, it's a little dank, but good kind too. But you can't quite figure out in what direction. Um, um, what would you like to do about the pitch darkness first and foremost? Oh, Ooh. Yali, flame on. Wait, are we gonna? Are we gonna? Not the flame on. Maybe small um, flame. Maybe sm just instead of both hands, how, maybe just like now one that we're finger. Here, can we tell how close the people that Dechen were talking about are? Well, they were on the roof, and you are now inside and underground. Oh, well, they were on the roof tunnel, outside. Tunnel. All right, I was thinking it was mm -hmm. a wool, you know, like in Zelda. There's a wall, like and, a then, and then there's sort of a yard, and then there's a castle. Yeah, no courtyard. <laughs> courtyard. We went right. That, to that's the a really castle. great accent, Coral. What is that? Um, I call it draconics. 
I'm sure he's not ashamed at all. I fucking hate it, personally. So. <laughs> was that you or was that? Ezra? That's Ozzy. Ozzy's like, I fucking hate it. Uh. All right. Um. So we've got. So what do we see once once Yali yeah. flames on? With the dim light of the fire hands uh, that yes. Yali controls, um, you see this is all kind of cobblestone. It's all like slick and moist, like if it's been, like it, it is a basement, um, very moldy. I don't know if anybody here really knew of the dangers of black mold, but it is rampant. Oh, uh, God. Most notably, um, on the side of the wall that you just kind of crawled out of, there are some of those shackles that are kind of like pinned to the wall and a couple mm. of skeletons that are dangling down, just setting the really, really the right tone for this kind of a dungeon. Coral goes over and makes one of them dance. <laughs> oh my god. Coral, what are you doing? Detrin is very scared and hides behind Azu. <laughs> a lot we're, of clacking. We're bonding. The Look, no. I made it dance. You know those are real human remains, right, no. Coral? Those used to be people. <laughs> Why would they be real? You hear a scream in the died. distance. <laughs> Coral, this is the Fire Lord, my other, other father's secret prison. People don't die in prison. Yes, they do. Oh, we have a lot to talk about, uh, about the prison they, they system. Definitely. and um... <laughs> Yeah. They die. I don't I've... even have a prison where I'm from. <laughs> that sounds great. Honestly, if someone okay. fucks Coral's up, we, right we, the town just comes together and beats them. <laughs> oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Wow, wow, mob justice. Okay. <laughs> it sounds worse. Um, I mean, we you know, we'll talk about this afterwards. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, just come over here. I think there's like black mold over there. So if you come over here, maybe... yeah, this is not good for health. Uh, yeah, Coral, hold on. Coral walks away, but her hands are behind her back. <laughs> you steal? Are you stealing bones? No. Coral. Coral. Are you holding a femur? What's a, a femur? Humorous? What's in your hand? <gasps> Coral. What's in my hand? I'm so glad you asked. <laughs> this is the Hobbit. Anyway, <laughs> it's in my pocket. She pulls her hand out, and there's a human hand. <laughs> ah. Girl, please, can you? That's kind of creep. No. Nope. I I I try to airbend the hand out of your hand. Hey, <laughs> do I need to make a contested bending check? No, I, I think that's something it. you can do pretty easily. Okay, I just knock it out. It falls apart into little itty bitty bones. Oh, I'm just trying to on. joke around, you know. I know, but like, we gotta go. We can look. I promise, I'll joke around with you later. Okay. Yeah, I appreciate that. There might not be a later. Well, if we don't do this, if we don't do this now, there definitely won't be a later. But if we do do this now, there might be. She said, "Do do." I just wanna. Azu, Thank just... you, Azu. See, we're goofing. <laughs> I do I just... think we should. We don't have any memories together, and we might not ever. <laughs> so, all right. If we make it through this, I'll show you. I'll show you something my mother taught me, even though she wasn't supposed to. It's a secret airbending fart technique. <gasps> what? No way. Wait. Yeah. Like you can. Make we gotta make it through it. Other people fart. Well, you can make Yali fart. No, you can make Yali. <laughs> Wait, you make can make Yali, Yali fart. fart. We, you, you don't. Should make Yali fart. I'm not you doing it right fire. now. Fire. We fire. have to go. We have to go I do now. Not give you permission to make you me promise. Fart. <laughs> I'm not going to make Yali. I'm going to show you the technique. I'm not going to make Yali. Why are we? Why are we bribing you the same way we bribed our brother outside? This makes no sense. <laughs> ah. I mean, we are In all the related, distance? so I guess it makes sense. Um, you can change. Cry and the chains are dragging closer towards you. Oh my god, a ghost! Have I heard of like a chain man? What like what urban legend? Chain, chain man? man, like a man <laughs> in, a chain in the palace. I'm gonna just wear the resource. Chain. Hold on, hold on. Uh, I like that. Spend... What? What is it? 
Bob, what was it? What was the name? Jacob Marley. Jacob Marley is in this. No, is that basically the Alex? I don't know that story. No. Oh, I, I have one of my resources is obscure or forbidden knowledge. I would like to use the move raid your lineage's resources without their consent or knowledge to like know if I know anything about like a chain person like in the secret prison. Yes. Oh okay. And to clarify, is this like there's actually someone in the Fire Nation who like is a chain wielder, or is this like a a tale you were told as a child to keep you out of the dungeons? Either or. A tale. <laughs> both. Yeah. Both I'm leading yeah. strongly towards tale they were told, um, or he was told, especially because like this is a part of the 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 royal palace that like isn't really talked about. This is where the prisoners uh, of war or other who go here and are never heard of again like oh they were released ha 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 you know gestures broadly at all the skeletons around you okay heck yeah uh so i got a nine which means i'm gonna choose i get to choose one from a list uh and i'm just gonna say uh i get to hold one resource and i'm going to steal yourself for what you're doing avoid marking a condition so i go it's the chain what, what's it called the chain, chain? <laughs> Man, Changer, what do we? Chain, it has to be. It's up to you. <laughs> it needs a good like pizzazzy name. Um, Chain Magician. <laughs> Chain. Chain. <laughs> Chain. <laughs> Are there any synonyms for chain? Like two? Like is it like four chains? The oh, two no. chains. Four <laughs> chains. <laughs> four chains. <laughs> It's four chains. It's like a combination of two chains. We got, com chain. we got Commander Typhlos, and we have to have two chains now. Do we need two <laughs> chains. In this? That's what the right. is coming from. Does Everyone. two chains have something he says, like in his song? Is there two, two, two chains? chains? Does he just yell <laughs> two chains? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah yelling turns. He just uh, yells two look. chains. <laughs> <laughs> like Typhlosion. <laughs> they all just say their names. <laughs> oh, yeah. it's so weird. <laughs> <Just> like, <okay. laughs> Yali turns with a look of like actual like pure terror in their face. Like you you've never seen them actually just look scared. And they go, everyone, shut up, quick, hide. Two chains is coming. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna see this is it an empty cell. I'm gonna just run into an empty cell and like Are we hide in, in a dark cell? corner. If oh I no, can. we're in a um what if we hey coral can you earthbend a wall in front of us really quickly uh yeah okay just like just so that it looks like this is the end of a corridor but it's not if we all squish up together and coral makes a fake wall then then he won't notice maybe they that's a good notice. idea as long okay. as he doesn't notice the wall going up maybe put your lights out yali yeah quick and like Flame a off. plunge into darkness. Flame plunge off. into darkness. We we huddle up next to each other and then wall up. It's like Casco to Montiliano, like <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> you hear thump, thump, drag, thump, thump, drag. The sound of two heavy footsteps dragging along the cobblestone as a chain follows behind. And this these footsteps start to head towards you and the dragging of the chain echoes as the screams fill the background. Eventually this figure, now the wall you've built, do you have any vision through it or is it just like a legit wall? I would try to match it to the, the rest of the walls as much as possible. Okay. You want me to put peepholes in it? <laughs> do, do you, do you want There's a portrait? Yeah. Wait, there's, yes. just a <laughs> there's like a, a portrait bust? made you of like a bust. <laughs> it's just, I love the bust idea too much, so we have to do that. <laughs> it's like it's a like very mansion. clue. Yeah, our haunted mansion. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and the eyes go. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> I don't know that I can you. see anything though, because uh lights it's went dark, out. Yeah. yeah. Are there any torches down in the dungeons? Doesn't seem not anything. really. You know, nothing more torturous than perpetual darkness. Um Okay, well then I think instead of that, I'm just gonna try, I would have tried to make the wall as match the ones around it as much as possible. And then I think Coral is just gonna like bend a knee and press their hands to the ground and try and decipher um, the shape and the situation of things with vibrations. Hmm. Is that a thing I can do? Uh, yeah. That, yeah. Uh, the wall you can do relatively tough. easily um but we're gonna rely on your skills and training um to 
kind of echo locate the form of this. Oh, I rolled well. Person. You just hear Coral go. (laughs) (laughs) No, I'm I'm not echolocating. I'm feeling the ground vibrations. Is different. Seismic location. Seismic location. I think it's like battleship, but you can feel things. I was going to say like moles, but I don't know. Yes, yeah, like moles. moles. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Um. Drawing your skills and training focus, which is a negative one for me, but I rolled pretty well. So that's a 10. Hey, oh. that's fantastic. Um, you just do really well. Okay. Um, so you have your hands pressed to the ground and through these bending means, you're able to kind of vibrate a feel for what this individual looks like. Now, two chains is i forgot earlier (laughs) we have the best character names in this show uh hands down anybody that thinks otherwise can probably fight azu um so (laughs) i want to vote a passing out so probably don't do that (laughs) (laughs) i'm not fighting them uh massive boots like steel-toed boots um i'm trying to think of a character that like i have an image for this person um who played Street Fighter? I played Street Fighter. Little the guy bit. that floats and has the hat, like the fuck. You I mean don't... Mortal Kombat? No. Um, okay. Massive Cause... arms and legs. He crosses his arms a lot. Um, Is he Russian? Probably. Zangief? No, not Zangief. I was thinking of Zangief, but it's not okay. him because he's often naked. Bison. Um, no, M. Bison. Bison. I think, I, Bison I is not naked. He always has a thing. Oh, he Sagat. always wears a uniform. Sagat, thank you. Sagat, yes, yes, yes. Thank you. He has boxing Dallas shorts on. Awesome. <laughs> and not much else. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Um, so this this man, massive, uh, strangely awfully naked, um, boxing shorts that are bedazzled um you can as you vibrate you can feel that they're covered in like chains and metals but also like a lot of them might be decorative um the shorts themselves are pretty short um they cup his very nice butt um quite bubbly <laughs> no it's- one else knows this I'm so you, you, this is so detailed from the gr- what and no one can see that that coral's face just heats up <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> Um, and like, the vibrations okay? travel up. I can't see shit. I can feel you. We're right out of sight to each other. You're we getting warm. the heat of my blush face. That's that's <laughs> too much. You've gone too far. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> Coral can feel the, the shape of someone's butt to the ground, but you cannot feel the heat of. I'm using earth blush. bending, you jerk. <laughs> Get it right. Uh, abs made of rocks. Uh, <laughs> Chains that are as thick as a man's wrist. Um, like, oh, I don't know anatomy words for chains. It's fine. Um, topless. And then it goes all the way up to his neck where there's like this. And here's the thing that I'm trying to imagine. In movies where there's like those dudes that cut off people's heads, they have these like okay. executioner uh, hoods. Yes. Yeah. But I want this one. It's made out of metal, like gold and red chain link mm. metal um it's got little eye holes um and maybe he a little just mouthful. seems like he's a pyramid head with an ass two chains oh, I mean... and you see chains. his fucking pyramid head <laughs> does have a nice ass too so this this is all checking he can make it clap he can make it clap oh my mm-hmm. god are you hearing the chains or hearing that ass who knows <laughs> the sound of my ass cheeks alerting the children <laughs> i hate it here <laughs> <laughs> um, um, that's what his voice sounds <laughs> <laughs> You better come out right now. I'm so no. <laughs> I mean, that's canon now. You, you know how it's scary. Works. That's we're just scary. We just me. squished up against the wall. We hear this voice. Hello, little ones. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, so two chains walks over to the hole in the wall that is shaped like uh, the right size that children could pass through. And he bends down and you just hear the whisper. Ah, huh, well, that's not right. I wonder where that little booger went. Well, then I just have to travel these halls and find out. Careless is not going to be happy that we lost little booger. <laughs> okay, I should go. And <gasps> so quick, cute. Did he say careless as a name? Careless as a name. Okay. Spelled and like then, the word? Uh, K A I R dash L I S. Oh. Is it last name Whispers? Yes, it is. <gasps> Stop. Don't Why lie. Are you like are this you B? Me? <laughs> Don't ever suggest something to B because B is a chronic yes and. Okay? You will just say yes. Said yes and to the Mickey Mouse voice. Or two chains. <laughs> ha <Ha-ha>, Two chains. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Ha <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. Mustn't oh. on the B. <laughs> <laughs> And you just hear the stomping and the chains you see it again to the distance. Okay, quick cue though. You yep. said he had tiny chains around his neck. Yep. Oh. Two of them. Is Carl do about it. to commit murder? Do it. I'm on? thinking about it. <laughs> Maybe she whispers, she's like, how do we feel about murder? M- mur- what? Um, oh, I like, would can you just like, knock him out? Yeah. Not murder? Yeah. I, I would rather just... not kill anyone. Yeah, I've never not... choked someone before. Oh, okay, well, you what? can, like, maybe if we did just for, like, a minute. A minute? Like, that seems like a long time. Is that? I don't know. Yeah, the airbender. You know about breathing and stuff, right? How long does it take to just knock someone out without hurting them? Da- do, do I know this? <laughs> like, when you you're drowning. Me. Like, when you're Have drowning. Have you ever tried to well, he's drown like someone? I don't know. Like, how vascular is he? <laughs> Very really vascular. vascular. <laughs> okay. I didn't know you could use that word in that way. That's cool. I'm gonna write that down. Um. <laughs> well, it might take a little while then because you know he's probably got a lot of air in him. But we could we could try for like yeah, thirty we... seconds. I think maybe he's gone his... now. <laughs> uh, oh. I mean, I can go and get him if you want me to. I can go. No. no. Okay. no. no. If you're if you're Azu and that guy is that guy, then <laughs> Wait, I am Azu. Wait, am I not Azu? I hit my head really hard with Hold one of his on. headbutts, so I don't know if I'm just mishearing oh, everything. Is he gone? Because I really love to not be squished up like this. Is he gone? Anymore. The sounds of the chains have receded pretty, pretty far um, into the distance. So you mostly just hear like screaming. And if you listen really, really hard, you can hear the gentle tooting of a flute okay <laughs> toot, toot. Toot, toot. that's got to be our father right i mean okay. how many people play the flute <laughs> and are also war criminals <laughs> and are also okay yeah prison. that narrows it down a bit actually. yeah 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 okay let's go i try to push against the wall i can't oh, sorry, okay. hold on. <laughs> i can't <laughs> <laughs> that just because it's still dark just f- fully just walks the wall. just fully bodies the wall <laughs> she's like let's go <laughs> ow <laughs> okay so I lower well, the wall yeah yeah wall comes down all right uh Yali flame on yeah you got it <laughs> maybe, we, maybe we think of a cooler thing to say I don't know. I think it was pretty cool, honestly. What's wrong with Flame On? I don't know. I think it's great. It's great because it's almost like you're like, if you line up the way, it's almost like you're like a human torch. It's actually pretty, pretty (laughs) cool. That's actually not a, that's actually a pretty cool name. Is it? it? I think it's a fantastic name. Is it? Well, a human torch makes me think that my whole body would have to be incandescent, right. oh, and it's true. just my hands. You're like yeah. lava hands. We're like walking and talking. Yeah. We're doing it. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're walking and talking. <laughs> yep. Uh, you hear somebody, there's a couple of the prison cells that do have people, uh, emaciated forms that are kind of like pitifully raising their hands towards you, you know, cries of like, oh, get wait. me out! I didn't oh. mean to murder an entire village! Oh, okay, never mind. I need to that. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Uh, Dejan's just walking straight in the middle like this. 
<laughs> a lot of atrocities left and right. Um, it's a good thing that mostly it's all shrouded in shadow. Uh, you get like the flickering lights, but I don't know if that makes it better or worse. Is that blood or is that piss on the ground? Who knows? Keep looking. Keep walking straight. Both. Mm, like, don't pee blood. Go to the doctor. <laughs> I don't think anyone here has a choice of going to a doctor. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, the doctor has to come to them. Yeah, yeah, Coral. They definitely treat people doctor. here. <laughs> Can somebody give me a assess a situation? Anybody with a good creativity? Oh, Everything's bad for me. I thought uh, I had yeah, okay creativity. Mine's a two. Yeah, yeah, Lily, you have great creativity. <gasps> Mine's a two. Yeah. Okay, so I rolled 11. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. On the floor. Lace down. So did I. <gasps> Look so at did us. I. Look at us. <laughs> nice. Yes. So Yali and I put our heads together. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> Are we supposed to do that, Azu? I leave. I, I bend down to my very tall head. Lies on well, top of Asu's like, head. Like he goes on his tippy toes as well. Yeah, oh, we just oh, try. Oh. Like, that's so. This would be a is. much more beautiful moment if there wasn't, you know, uh, a, a war criminal to the left. It's like, oh, I'll, I'll do it again. I'll do it. I'll murder them all. Get over <laughs> here, you kids. I'll murder you too. Oh. <laughs> no thanks. I'm, you know, for I'm the good. first time, I'm actually in agreement with my third father's decision to put all these horrible murderers down here. Is this like, there's so many of them. I know, there's just yeah. so many serial killers down here. <sighs> I'm just wondering what- serial killer? <laughs> oh, um, so when a killer kills more than, I think, like, three or four people, I think there is actually, like, an actual, like, limit, like, amount we have to reach before they become- you know, maybe we should talk about this later. Why don't you send um, the justice mob after them after the first time? <laughs> <laughs> How does it come to that? <laughs> Sometimes you just get away with these things. I've read about it in my father's reports. Hmm. Uh, so what two to four questions would you like to ask? I want to ask what here can I slash we use to convince our father to tell us the truth the whole truth and nothing but the truth <laughs> oh my god <laughs> your boiler's brain <laughs> do you know that technique no <laughs> but i could hold him down <laughs> while yali does it <laughs> what i don't think that coral is the, the, the dangerous one here dana and... said that okay <laughs> <laughs> right can we use? Um, probably just the threat of being in this part of the prison. Um, mm -hmm. If you can threaten to hold any weight um, with the actual royal family, that could be strongly used in your favor. Okay. Yeah. It's actually really useful because I am connected in that way. All right. Exactly. Uh, Coral. Do you have a question under the assessor situation as well? Because you and uh, Yali rolled well. Yeah, I got a 12 after my bonus. Um, what is take one ongoing when ask, acting on the answers? Does that just mean you get a um, plus one to all your rolls related yeah. to what the questions were asking? So like if I said the biggest threat was giant dinosaur chasing you, if you then had to roll to dodge said dinosaur, you would have mm. plus one ongoing to do with the dinosaur that was chasing you. Um, what's my best way? What's the best way to get to our dad? Um, following the sound of the flute sounds without, like the... without getting discovered, I guess. <laughs> yes. Sounds like the most direct way, but as you look down, you can see the distinct um, markings on the ground of those chains that have been dragged. And it seems like two chain follows a very specific path down here. He's so as long as you can head. follow. <laughs> yeah, it's just, I don't know anything about pyramid head. So heck, how did I do this? <laughs> two chains is cooler. It's fine. Yes, that's true. <laughs> Uh, so you just gotta dodge or uh, avoid the areas where you can see the markings that two chains has passed. 
Okay. I'd like to hold my other question if that's okay. Yeah. How about right. you, uh, Coral? Hold or ask another? I'm looking at the questions. Other than two chains, what should we be on the lookout for? Um, it hasn't really been revealed who the masked figure is, if sure. that's two chains, if that's somebody else. Um, so that's something that you kind of have nagging in the back of your head. Okay. All right. So are you going to take the alternate path to head towards the cell where you hear the flute music tootin? Yeah, I think maybe if, if people step forward just to follow it directly, Coral just like throws out an arm and is like, let's go this way so we don't, you know. <laughs> That's, that's a good mess good with that on our way i like bend over and i whisper to my half siblings who do we think careless is that couldn't be our father right i mean if he's in a name if he's I in mean, a jail cell how's he controlling things i don't know well, remember what booger said sometimes they take tea it seems like maybe he's holding court down here in some way i don't know if our dad's smart enough to do stuff like that He's definitely. We not don't know smart. our dad at all. It's true. I don't know him, but I'm pretty sure he's not smart. You're just mad. <laughs> Doesn't mean I'm not right. So, there. Means your judgment is skewed. Doesn't mean it's not correct. Still, so. Doesn't mean it is correct. No. Mm. Mm. The closer you get, the more the music kind of fills your ears and the sound of screaming and moaning and just general I'm dying sound starts to fade away and finally you hear the most hearty heartfelt rambunctious just full of joy laugh <laughs> Ah, uh, now that's a really good joke, Two Chains. You really ought to come by more often and tell me these. You know, it's like you're keeping them all to yourself locked up in here. And you hear the sound of like a really, really good back slap. Uh, Is I, he I, flirting I, with Two Chains? Uh, uh, can we duck into a cell? Is there an open one? Yeah. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Um, this one, it's it's open and there is a body but the body is recently deceased oh my god <laughs> that makes it a lot better <laughs> yali flame off <sighs> i see I it's flame off. not cool <laughs> i i like it personally i'm, I'm trying to think of one here me. coral it's nice why'd you go I'm... ugh what well, because the you're making me feel bad i came Shh. up with the flame on flame off and i was set <laughs> We were trying to get yeah, shh. 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 Not you, Coral. Touch it, shh. Do we hear What do we hear? <laughs> do we hear? <laughs> <laughs> you all touch each other. <laughs> um, the conversation kind of carries over to your ears. Now, what's that, two chains? You say that you couldn't find Booger. Not my little booger, my sweet child. <laughs> I love that little booger. One day when he turns into pure evil, he'll be able to harness the power of the brain boiling technique. But for now, oh, yeah, I, I, I have an appointment soon. But booger was supposed to be back by now. I can't, I can't leave. No, can you? No, you seem terrified. Seen to, to him outside. <laughs> There's like 30 people outside. Yeah, Al is just like, baby, baby, baby. <laughs> His wings. <laughs> <laughs> touch me like this, and I'll touch you like that. Oh my god. I, feel like I also have to know. Succumbed. <laughs> oh no! To the to the to the uh, cucumber. What's it called? Concussion? No, he is not. <laughs> uh, he is still conscious and well. I have yes, to know uh, this other voice we're hearing. Mm -hmm. Do we only hear one side of yes, a conversation? 
Yes. Even though we sh- this should like be a able Tom to Tom Hanks vote? coconut scenario? I kind of, I would Or like would a beautiful be mind with Russell Crowe and the guy who plays Vision. <laughs> <laughs> the guy who plays Vision. <laughs> 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 I thought we decided he looked like like the what lead singer of Death Cab for Cutie. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I think that's what we think he looks like. I don't oh think right, any right, of right. Us no, you're right, him. you're right, you're right, right. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Uh, I I only hear one half of the conversation. What's happening? I do mean I volleyball. <laughs> it's harder to draw on a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> that's why you got to carve a face into it. Should we just wait for two chains to like leave, or should we jump out now? We should wait for two chains to leave. Yeah, let's, let's wait a little bit longer to see what they say. But we're not hearing any chains or no footsteps. I don't think he's no. there, y'all. All right, let's y'all. let's creep out Scooby Doo gang style. Uh-huh. Like, oh yeah, one head here, one head here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the heads <laughs> like, go up. Somehow Ozzy's somehow Ozzy's on top, and then you just take oh, a yeah. camera around, and you see us like he's standing on someone's back. Yeah, you're sitting on his <laughs> <Jen> shoulders. The <laughs> <laughs> only third. Oh, oh my god, Yali's definitely and... on, on the top head, <laughs> <laughs> the leader. <laughs> oh, I still live for Ozzy standing on somebody's shoulders. <laughs> Um, as the four of you kind of peek around the corner, there's a flicker of light, maybe two cells down, and you hear the creak of a cell open, and a man steps out. A man? Now, <sighs> just one, a solo man. <sighs> Shocking. A man, a man has come. <laughs> Teaches his manly ways. Not this, not today. <laughs> <laughs> this is a short individual. He is about five. He's coming out of the cell, or he's going into coming it. Out of the cell, okay. he is tiptoeing out of the cell. He is barefoot. He's got the most powerful leg hair you have ever seen. He's wearing torn off shorts, a ratted tunic. Um, he's got some, um, what are the the garments or the, the fashions that you can wear under forearm? Are yeah. braces? Uh, gauntlets? No. Vans? The hands as well. Braces. I think Hand, braces. Hand wraps? I think braces. Are they metal? Is it smaller than a bread box? Yes. <laughs> oh, are they metal? I know. Okay, From playing so RuneScape, I know the term is van braces for our van braces is what I, I was Connie. thinking. Okay. I believe Connie. Okay. RuneScape knows all. Um, wearing <laughs> some non-metal van braces. Um, he has long, long, long hair. Now we are talking past the butt long. Um, it's if it was brushed, it might be nice. It's got some really nice waves, but all the waves are kind of um, clumped. Um, he turns, and at the tip of his finger, he has a little flame lit. And you just see the sleepiest eyes. Half his face, all the way down his neck into his shoulder, where you can just kind of see like the top of his clavicle, is burnt flesh. But despite those imperfections, this is a handsome dour looking man dour and means sad color his eyes. dour means sad you mean dapper yeah oh! ah! he what just looks dapper dapper means, dapper means like, fancy. Well put was not together right word. And handsome. well put together so it's not dapper but he is handsome no. he can be handsome and sad I do it every day yeah he's like <laughs> <laughs> it's, like my, it's like my chemical romance I guess I don't know <laughs> you know what yeah yeah Looks really emo, but filled with not enough sadness. Too much energy for sadness. So whatever that adjective is, that's, that's that let us called know. called a manic episode. <laughs> <laughs> I would know. <laughs> I'm Does, do I know, do that. I get have a gut feeling that this is our father? Oh, yeah. What color are his oh, eyes? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to yeah. immediately, I'm or charging I? out of cover, and I'm going to punch him. Lighter. I'm going to Superman punch him. What? I just charge okay. out and jump and punch him <laughs> just immediately. 
Mainly because I want to clear a condition. I can do this by taking a full hearty action without talking to my companion. So that's what I'm going to do. Wow. <laughs> do it. I'm actually yeah. in support of this. Yeah. Uh, so it's was, like, totally in character, so you go out. for it. Yep. So like I jump off of the Chen's shoulders and just <laughs> run and just, just punch. I fall over because I'm not used to someone jumping off my shoulders. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, that's very oh my God. Do you do a flip? <laughs> um, you know what? Let me roll for it. What do I roll for? Flip. Um, <laughs> she's just like bodies on wall, and then just <laughs> like in training. Please, I'll catch okay. you. I'll catch you. I do not do a flip. Um, I rolled a three. So <laughs> break your neck. <laughs> so I, try, I jump off, face plant, just real hard. <laughs> but I get out bloody Slut. nose. I would take a. I would take like coral catches with, me. With but Azu, you're just on your own. I'm just on yeah. my face. I get a bloody nose and I just get up and just keep charging and then jump at him. I probably like alerted him with that fall for sure. Yeah. Yeah. So there's a tenuous moment where um, Careless, because he was sneaking out of his cell. What? Um, his knew it. I knew it. I knew <laughs> it. I knew it. Let it slip. <laughs> <laughs> um, he was sneaking out of his cell. <laughs> trying to <laughs> deceive anybody who might have been listening. Um, and then his head snaps over as he sees this child face plant. Blood starts pouring out of the kid's nose. And the kid gets back up and starts chasing after him. Careless in a panic, throws his arms up. Oh, I didn't do it! What? What are we... Uh... Perfect, your face is open. I'm going to go and punch him. <laughs> punch him square in the face. Uh, give, me, give me push your luck. Let's push your luck. You punch okay. him even after realizing like, uh, half his body has been fucking burned off. Yes. It happened a while ago. Mm. It looks like it happened a while ago. It Dang. looks fresh, doesn't it? Oh, it's fresh? It's an established. It's like a, it's like a year old scar. Two years? Mm. I don't know. Burn scars, if I'm being honest. Oh. It looks healed over. I thought so it was I'm... like um that Batman guy. Two face? Two face. Yeah. Two -face? Harvey Dent, yeah. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah, nah, more like Go. Oh, Deadpool! Ew! Hey! Say, ew! I love That's Deadpool. Draco's whole body is gross. I ah! love Deadpool. Draco, I'm so sorry. Your boyfriend's gross. <laughs> he's he's beautiful on the inside. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but B, he loves his daughter. He does, and he's very adorable. Okay, I can talk about this for goddamn hours, but I'm not going to because we don't have that much time. <laughs> so, what's your role? Um, oh, it's a punch. Um, uh, yeah, think... with passion. Uh, okay, passion. Uh, I rolled a 10. Dance, nice. You're one passionate son of a bitch. Don't talk about his mother like that. <laughs> 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 what does this perfect punch look like? <gasps> So I think I charge towards him, like blood, just blood streaming from my nose. Because I definitely, like, definitely is bleeding right now from that fall. Um, and I think I go for a punch, like swing for the the <laughs> between the legs, and just as like slow enough, like I telegraphed it enough for that for him to like instinctively like punch over to cover up. And as he like uh -huh. punches over to get close to, me, he gets close to me, and I headbutt him. Just, ah! and jump up, just very quickly change and jump up to headbutt him in the face. Um, and I just like stagger back because it's falling on my back, just breathing heavy, like, <sighs> <laughs> I can, I can die happy now. Uh, it's gonna lie here now. <laughs> I rush over to Azu. <laughs> Hi, Careless. why are there two of you again? Um, is, do you have a twin that I didn't know about? No. Shh, okay. Just okay. stop talking. Just stop talking. Okay. Careless grabs his face. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my. This is why I hate kids. Oh my God. What? What did I? Do you even know? Do you know who I am? Regrettably, I think <laughs> we do. Regrettably. <laughs> why are there? Wait. Are you the kids that Booger was getting? Where's Booger? Is that kid still? That's 
Happy cut scene. My kid. <laughs> yeah, man. Your toxic tongue slipping under. There's no rhythm. Oh Booker, Booker's just like a backup dancer. <laughs> like, popping He's and doing watching. the noodle arms that soccer does in the desert. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> noodle arms. <laughs> Are you? Oh, you all look. Oh, you're my kids, aren't you? Is there yeah. more of you? There was supposed to be more. There They're was supposed to be like twenty-five dead. of you. What? I'm pretty what? sure most of my dead. What? Wait, Azu, why would you say that? Because he deserves uh, to know. Oh. And it's all oh. your fault. Yeah. Yeah. That's my if bad. I could stand up, I would headbutt you again. You but I'm know, so that tired. really hurt. You are a tiny child, but you are very strong. Wait, wait, kind wait. Kind of like wait, how wait. I was when I was a kid. Oh, tall one, go ahead. Oh, wow. I'm perfectly you... average height. I put my hands on Ozzy's shoulder. And I'm like, you knew that you had so many children and you knew that they, so many had died. Did you... Because of you? Did you ask them to come here for this? I, well, so the way it is, is freedom was granted if I could teach somebody else my secret technique. It's a terrible technique, really. I don't, I stumbled upon it in a forest, in a bog, and I talked to a spirit. But that's, that's besides the point. What is the point is... I am sorry. Oh hell no! Detching gets just... really angry, but Detching cannot start a fight. So Detching looks at her siblings. <laughs> yeah. this this okay, 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 I, don't, I don't think you've yeah, ever seen me... her this angry. <laughs> you should explain faster. Um. Um. So I. I am doing work on behalf of some of the concubines. Uh, me, me and a friend go way back, and they're doing some work on behalf of the Fire Lord. And in order to spare my life, I had to do a thing. And like, let me just say, okay, okay, let me, kids, kids, was there more? There's only what, this is there's it. Like six, seven. And can you oh, be more specific? Oh. Names. Oh. Can we describe the thing. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. And he starts to, like, chew his nails. Okay, okay. Uh, let's let's herd into my cell. Two Chains is gonna start his rounds again, and um, he gets a little whippy with the chain if you're not not in the cell. Um, I have tea. It's moldy, but it, it, it's, it's tea. Uh, okay, nobody wants tea. All right, so um, a lot of years ago, before I was wandering the lands, I stumbled upon uh, the secret technique. Now, this was a technique of brain boiling that could be utilized by any bender of any caliber, any skill. Now, the Fire Lord wants to utilize this ability to empower his soldiers to win the war against whatever it is they want to win the war against. I didn't want that. I didn't want that for anybody. So the way I saw it was... If I made a bunch of babies, I could pass this ability onto them and absolve myself of ever having to deal with the Fire Nation. Didn't really work out that way, so welcome new potential protégés! Uh, you uh, literally made us to take your spot? Uh... I, you see, I came up with a plan like 20 years ago, 15. Detcha was How? taking out like a plate of cookies that she especially oh made God. for her dad. Oh and then she God. puts it back in her pack. <laughs> That's how you know you fucked up. <laughs> That's how you know. Who is the concubine you're working with? Uh, mm, I slept with him, oh God, like 14, 15 years ago. Uh, really pretty face. Often shows up to our meetings wearing a mask because he doesn't want anybody to know his face. But like, it's gotten really tight with the Fire Lord. Just slowly. Coral just looks at Yali. <laughs> yeah. This we all look at Yali. We all, this, this slow entire head time, all the siblings. <laughs> this entire time, Yali has still been around the corner. I don't think they've stepped out into the hall. Uh, 
And okay. now when all of you turn to look at the corner, Yali finally steps into the hall and like looks at like this long lost father. And I don't think this is intentional, B. Uh, but if you'll allow it, I can make a roll yeah. to see how severe it is or if I avoid consequences. But I think they start to boil their dad's brains. <gasps> Ooh, I love yeah, I think it. it's completely unintentional. <laughs> I yes. okay, can I can I see like this happening and try to interrupt it? How would like, he know? it still like does it and partially does it? But like, I think seeing Yali staring daggers at um, our father and our father most likely reacting to their brain being boiled. I don't oh, think it'd be. Going, a... <laughs> 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 I would like to see if I could. So I wanna, like... what you're going to do, Azu, is call somebody out. Where you're calling someone if to live up to their principles. Mm, um, yeah. This is going to be a role with. Um. Uh... I'm not sure. I feel like you just roll two d six. Uh, you, you name and roll with their principal. Oh, you name. Okay, so their what's your principal? principal? Mine are uh, tradition versus progress. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, I don't know how it's gonna yeah. fit in this. Well, traditionally, oh my you gosh. wouldn't boil your dad's brain. Right? Yeah, <laughs> so, <laughs> progressively you would. <laughs> <laughs> it is progress. It's a leftist swat. <laughs> <laughs> this is the this is the future liberal swat. <laughs> Okay, so tradition. I, I guess? have a minus two tradition, so go for it. Yeah, it's gonna be hard. Um, an eight. So on a seven or nine, they can change your mind, your own mind, in turn. You must mark a fatigue, or they may shift your balance as they choose. Okay. Yeah. Um. I think, like, I just barely, after, like, still very much concussed from all of the headbutts I've been given, like, sagger onto my feet and just run at Yali and, like, try to tackle them to the ground and just say, Yali, you're, you're doing the thing. You can't kill him, okay? I know how awful he is, and I want to hurt him so damn badly, but we can't, we can't kill him, and especially not with that technique. It's... It's what the Fire Nation wants. You're using it the way that they want to use it. I think I think what the technique looked like uh, before you tackle Yali to the ground yeah. as they like step around the mm -hmm. corner is you see like their their hands begin to glow red, but not like all the way, like they usually do, just the veins. Ooh. And like as the veins glow red, they go up their arm and like th the sides of their neck like burn up like molten like veins of lava like all the way up to like either side of their eyes so it's like their like eyes become like they turn from emeralds flecked with gold to these like swirling pools of like crimson red and like they're like looking at their dad and their dad's probably gonna start to feel his brain start to boil a little oh, uh, as yeah. yali's standing there and then you 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 break yali out of it and you tackle them to the ground um and they like like the veins begin to dissipate but their eyes are still glowing as they look up at you this entire time, I thought maybe the worst thing he could have been was negligent. But this was intentional, Azu. He made us to take his place, like Coral said. He, he's not just a coward, he's... He's a murderer. Any of us who died attempting this... It's his fault. We're lambs taken to the slaughter. And we have to make him pay for it. And I, I'm the last person to say they shouldn't. But if you kill him, you're no better than him. I'm already no better than him. All three of my fathers, the Fire Lord, who asked for this. Careless, who did this. And my other father, who's an accomplice in this. Nothing about me is good, so let me just kill him no, and end it all now. No, you have nothing to do with them, okay? They might be your parents, but they're not you. You don't carry their sins. That's on them. You're Yali. Azu's right, Yali. I was always scared of what the Fire Nation represented, but it wasn't until I met you that... I realized that there could be good people 
And if anything, I'm grateful to have you in my life. Even if our dad's a really terrible person and she starts like weeping, but like not like she's, yeah, she's just weeping as she's saying this. And um, you can see like little dust devils like starting to circle around her <laughs> because she's upset. And I think at this point, um, she just shakes her head and walks out of the cell. <laughs> it's just like, like, I don't want to be around this person anymore. So are you kids going to work with me? I what, think, what, what's I think the in, like, he gets cut off because an Coral, Coral like unstrands like a couple of the bars of the jail cell and wraps mm. him up like a, like a, a coil, including like one covering his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> like a kind of uh, like a gag of metal. I think, think should... this is gonna stop me. This is really stupid. I think we should take him with us, and I think we should leave him somewhere. Before we do, and I look down at Yali, do you want to get a punch in? It does. It is very cathartic. You know what? Yeah, yeah, I do. I do want to get a punch in. No. Oh yeah, no like flame. No like don't flame, flame on. But... It's kidding. I won't kill him. Yeah. I'm just gonna punch him really, really, oh, really hard. Uh, Can we punch no. him outside? Because two chains might be coming back. <laughs> no, okay, just make it fast. Just make it fast. Okay, <laughs> Deshin, it'll be fast. <laughs> Yali Yali gets up, right? Talked down by their friends, right? Like the veins recede, right? <laughs> like, like their eyes become normal again. They walk over to their chained up dad. Uh flame off, but it's the signet ring is on and they yes. they they cock their their ring hand back and they try to if this is okay they try to shatter the ring against Ooh. this guy's jaw like just like shatter <laughs> and break there the is ring metal there so uh-huh strategically placed knuckles well push your luck on this regardless Ooh. the punch will happen but this will determine I'll, the level of shatterability <laughs> i will help can i help Aww. by um Quietly coaching Yali's form. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Make sure your thumb's not tucked. Yeah, don't tuck your thumb in. I broke my thumb. I feel like that. Yali knows good. that. <laughs> Yali would. Yali's the most I, I trained in it. Yali would totally have had a, co a boxing coach. Like, let's yeah, be real. Sure, but... <laughs> I let Azu coach me. Uh, with Azu's help, it's an eight. Uh, Yali is the so, Annie yeah. of our group. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Um, I think the only consequence is some of the shards kind of fly back and hit you a little bit, but it's that's fine. I didn't get a cool cut on my cheek. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, and then there's a moment with the the bars that are wrapped around um, careless, and then you hear like the bars kind of like creak out of his mouth and start to unwind. Okay, okay, I think you've had your fun. And just as he's about to speak, you can hear the very very close sounds of thump thump. Scrape. Wait, wait, wait how happened? did he get those Scrape. off? He is he I the don't... avatar? <laughs> is he the avatar? Sorry, not the avatar. Whoa, what was that ever? ever? I already I forgot. Had... He's a firebender, right? Firebender. firebender, firebender. Yeah, he was lighting something on his finger. I thought he was an earthbender. Okay. No, how would he say. boil brains with earth? You can vibrate Imagine. the iron. Um, iron uh, I, we've decided like blood. any bender we can boil about, brains, yeah. right? Oh. Yeah, all the boiling would be done. But you're right. He cannot move metal. Um, so what he's going to do instead is nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he's very balanced. He might have fallen over. I like to imagine that. When you're wrapped up like a little spring. Uh, oh my god. What if he, he falls over like a slinky? I just starts, I just starts <laughs> drinking away from us. Uh, uh, I, I think maybe if he wants to get a word in after Yali punches him, maybe that like shifted the bar off yeah. his mouth a little. Yeah. I think that's cool, yeah. And uh, <laughs> you kids are the worst. I stuff a but... cupcake in his mouth. I stuff. <laughs> I my help. I'm gonna help you. B's trying you to B's trying to move the plot line, and we're like, no, yeah. <laughs> I went, no. Mm -mm. no. Yeah, you should have you know made what? your dad so awful. <laughs> That's <Right>? on you. <laughs> you know what, Careless? You are going to help us on our terms. We're getting out of here. We're finding the rest of our half siblings. 
I assume I, I like pause in my like impassioned speech like real fast. I, I hit stop on that. Like turn to my siblings because that's what we're doing, right? Oh, yeah, no, absolutely. Make up oh, yeah, for all of this, help. we're finding the rest of them and warning them. Okay, yeah. And I turn back to him, and you are going to help us. No strings oh. attached on your side. That's the least you can do to make up for all of this bullshit you put all of us through. You'll have to face the uh -huh. Justice Squad. What? A justice yeah. mob. You don't want to know. It honestly sounds terrifying, and we I feel like back. the prison system might be better, which is saying something. <laughs> no, no, no. I okay. Let's 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 get out. I yeah. I, I I look at Coral. I'm like, can can you earthbend us out of here? <laughs> like, well, where are we trying to go? The secret tunnel. We have to go to the secret tunnel, right? Wait, are we trying to leave? We're trying to go deeper in the castle. Are we? That's can we just jump? bust out of here straight up? I don't think they, like they have any of the kids. Us. I think they don't have the other. kids. I is think they were waiting we... for us to get down here. Yeah, I think they're waiting for us specifically because. Uh, yeah, I think we. I don't the think children. there are any other. Mm -hmm. Then wh who were the kids? You you just mean go going to... go around and warn them? Yes, yeah. yes. around the world. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yep. Sorry, I misunderstood. Around the world, around the world. Um, go well, off, I think we can ring. just we can just shuffle back <laughs> to the kid hole, and I can make it a little bigger for our slutty dad. Yeah, right? okay. We can do that. Got to get around two chains. He just sort of spirals through the no, hole. He's okay. I got, like a drill. I got two <laughs> it's, I mean, two changes coming this way. We're here. The hole's back here. Yeah. So we're right? shooting back. Yeah. We're yeah. running away. Okay. okay. I don't. I'm not gonna make it big enough for two chains, who was literally the size of a <laughs> of pyramid a tank. Head. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> oh, the train. Oh, yeah. I mean, she just, <laughs> just, you just shoot him through. <laughs> I think, yeah, so we, we make okay, a beeline for the. We scurry through. I pop that tunnel. bitch like a cork. Bam! <laughs> All right, so you're on your way to the hole um, with the distant sound of chains dragging behind you and the kind of wriggling form of Careless as he frustratedly um, tries to spit out whatever cupcake was left in his mouth and yeah. is just like complaining nonsensically. Um, and as the five of you kind of shuffle your way, weaving your way through the cells, the um, if this was like an RPG map, there'd be lots of treasure to find, um, lots of hidden items. Well, shit. <laughs> I know, missed opportunity. I love prison cells in video games. It's the only time I think they're great. So much. There's always something in the toilet. Always. Yeah. It's I'm great. Just, yeah. Mm -hmm. Even in Pokemon, sometimes. <laughs> Wait, why is there treasure something? in the prison? That's a good People point. drop stuff. Maybe guards <laughs> drop stuff. Yeah, maybe yeah guards they just drops. drop and like it's treasure. Stuff. It's a lost and found yeah. chest. It's a lost the and found chest. The guards aren't treated like... well. Why do you think they're so abusive? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Um, can, can we all like, yeah. roll to see what treasure we pick up on the way out? Wait, yeah. Yes! <laughs> sure. I got a 10! <laughs> okay. Uh, let me come up with a table on the spot. Um, oh, I got a 6. A 10. You get a... Um, a, like a... A necklace with a giant gemstone, but it's amber, and there is a seashell on the inside with like a little bug, a little, uh, what's a good combo? Um, something in a shell and an octopus. About to say a shelled yeah. octopus? That's just a Pokemon. Perfect. You got an almondite. You got an almondite. Almondite. We got all the, we get all the uh, generations in this. So. <laughs> We're going to bring it back to uh, life. <laughs> <laughs> I um, I wrote a nine. You find um why is there treasure down? <laughs> <laughs> you find a shoe, but the shoe is made out of pure silver and the lining is made out of velvet. Don't wear the shoe. Yeah, is it like no. a kid shoe? Is it like one of those like specialty like sh Isn't, silver shoes oh, you get at a jewelry store? Decorative. It's like a, a grim, decorative shoe. My brain really went to like a, the Grim Tales version of Cinderella, I think it was. Where um oh, no, not like Grim the Tales. Shoes. Yeah, the burning shoes where they like yeah. they were forced to wear hot like burning shoes. Oh, those I think were iron though. Forever, yeah. Huh. <laughs> I was thinking Terrible. of like, baby shoe. torture, so you know. Because uh, rich people yeah. sometimes do that. They like dip baby shoes in silver and gold. Oh, God. The burnsing process. 
I feel like we should just bronze the baby at that point. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Me. <laughs> no. Me and uh, me and Careless are blending a little bit. I was um, gonna say, I see where he gets it from. Yeah, yeah. I'm child free. That was amazing. I hate uh, <laughs> That's why I nah, made 25 right. of them. <laughs> Minimum. Minimum. At least 25. <laughs> my sperm is so potent. Oh my god. Okay. Um, we get Michelle, to the... what number did you get? <laughs> I rolled a seven. Thank you for asking. Seven? Yes. Um, You find a... <laughs> Just a piece of baking equipment. I thought you were going to um, say a piece of bacon. Me too. I was like... <laughs> I love that too. You just cry? You sure. just cry? Because razor wing <laughs> could be bacon. Oh my, oh my god, god no. God. You find a muffin you tin. Could. You find a muffin tin, just a muffin tin. I, I love it. I just look at it I'm like useful. I put it in my bag and I go. How practical. Uh, Connie, what did you roll? Six. Ooh. Um you find one of the longest shoulder pauldrons. <laughs> You've only one, but it's like eight feet long. You have to eight hold it upright. Feet. What the fuck? It's a good thing there's I, I, pick, here. I pick it up and I put it back down. <laughs> I can't <laughs> Like, yeah, do no. not want that. <laughs> okay, so Hilarious. moving things along, um, you get towards the very end of this tunnel. It is, um, you know, there's the shadows, um, there's a little bit of light. And then before that, Yali's hands kind of illuminate the hole that only children can fit through, you hear clapping. Oh my god, it's definitely your fucking dad, Yali. Get him know, out of here. I, I know, I know, I know, I know. It's my dad. Well, well, well. My Why is he child... so sexy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's a concubine. Come yeah, on. That's true. That's true. Fair. He's got a job to do. That's the job. It's two chains <laughs> cheeks clapping. It's not. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate it. Whose cheeks clap harder? Uh, <laughs> two chains or Yali's dad? <laughs> Ooh, oh my god. He's Definitely walking all day long. Everybody in the Far <laughs> Nation just does so many squats. <laughs> just, it's it's kind of outrageous. If you do too many the squats, ass. they're not going to be flapping around, right? <laughs> It'd be hard as stone. There's a fine medium. Okay. Um, so Yali's father claps and then gazes upon Yali. The child returns, and with what? The biggest mistake of my life. Careless. Where's he standing? How did he get here? That's a mystery. I'm asking you, Thee! I need a mystery! I don't have to answer everything. That's true. That's true. Um. <laughs> <clears throat> Father. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> you didn't see any of this because if you did then the fire lord would never forgive you for letting four infiltrators leave with a prisoner of war so you're just gonna turn around and walk back down that tunnel and let us go. Uh, roll to intimidate. Should have kept that pauldron. Sweet <laughs> <Just> fire child. <laughs> right? <laughs> With passion? I have like a zero in passion. Okay. I, uh, I would like to help. Can we all help. help just by looking yeah. feisty? Yeah, we all look real feisty. Uh, I need I'm... help because I rolled a one. <gasps> and oh, that's no. a five. Wait, that's a six. You... That's a six. Okay, Wait, I'll help. Can you push your luck to do it again? Is that a thing? Are you roll he they rolled a six. That's a different so, roll. Yeah. I just need one help to bring that up to a I, I'll help. I'm just standing there. I look bloodied and I'm bleeding from my forehead. I'll have a crazy look in my eye after, and a weird satisfaction after getting to headbutt my dad. I think I'm just terrifying to kind of look at. So maybe I'm just like standing beside um <laughs> Yali, like just bouncing on my feet, almost like an excited kid ready to get into a fight again. I also next to y'all, I just look very tall. I'm just <laughs> very tall. Like, just because you are, yeah. I'm just very tall, and it's hard to see my face, so I look very intimidating. <laughs> Even though oh, I'm not. I'm squeezing the life out of a grown man with metal <laughs> <I> control. 
It's a beautiful thing. That is okay, true. Okay, so that is the help from Coral's Mark and the Fatigue or Azu? Azu? I'm I think it's fatigue. Azu, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was just putting That's a seven. We can't all help, oh, right? Quick question. What happens when you get five fatigue? Are you going to freaking pass out? <laughs> So angry, he passes out. <laughs> yeah, okay. he probably does have a concussion. He's headbutted like twenty people today. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and narrate this final scene since uh, we are approaching time. I just have to sneeze first. Hold on, let me look at the light. Booger, booger, red, green, purple, <laughs> orange. Oh, Bless didn't you. Work. Thank you. No fire. <clears throat> Yali um, makes their case and threatens their, I want to say less sexy father, but that is an incorrect statement, um, the, the stern father. And he chuckles. And as he laughs, we see Azu's body kind of start to totter a little bit. And there's like another uh, spill of blood that drips from Azu's forehead and Azu's nose, and then he hits the ground. I catch and him. Okay. You want to catch him? Okay, perfect. I catch him. Um, a lot of things happen all at once. To the left, to the right of Yali is where uh, Careless was standing, and identical to how it looked on Yali. The flames or the the flames fill the veins and they go up his arms all the way up to his eyes where they're filled with red. And Careless is staring intently at Yali's other father. Oh my there... god. <laughs> Didn't he do this before? <laughs> is a tense moment where Yali's other father a clear liquid at first starts to what come out fuck? of his ears and then blood starts to pour out of his eyes. The other man steps in front of Careless and all four children hear a whisper of, I'm so sorry. I loved you more than I thought. And there's a burst of flame as Careless's stomach erupts in fire and gore. The two men die in each other's arms and slide to the bottom of this dirty floor. Well, Yali's traumatized what? for just life. We're all traumatized. <laughs> <laughs> We're just standing there covered in the blood of our father and for Yali, their other father. And Does this also blow a hole in the wall? Yeah, I like that. And there's a beautifully human-sized exit now. You hear in the distance uh, some really nice Celine Dion. <laughs> I don't know why I said nice, but that's what you hear. Wow, that was mean to me. <laughs> Ah, Connie! Connie zoomed in. <laughs> I zoomed in. So the four of you are able to step out. It is still daylight, and you hear that music in the distance, the gore behind you, and the destructive, the destruction of the building in front of you. I whistle. I, I come to my senses, and we're covered in blood. I, I whistle for uh, Razor Wing. Uh, instantly, Razor Wing gallops out with uh, Booger sitting on Maybe like on his nose, s scooping up some of the slobber and like painting the side of the walls with it. What Completely unaware of the trauma present in front of you. I I uh, just I just get up on on Razor Ring and I hold a hand out to my siblings. There are no words. It's just uh, we we have to go. Can I retcon something really quick? Yeah. Like on the way out, like maybe Coral's the last one out and she, I don't know. She's like checking their dad's pocket to see if there's like, I don't know, like a journal or a list of all the children he's propagated. 
<laughs> Wrapped around a pristine flute. Actually, a flute would be in a case. Yeah, you can grab a flute case and inside, underneath like the, the fuzzy parts, is a, a rather long list of a variety of names. Okay. So I'll I'll take the the flute case and then just do like one last look at the gore before following everyone out. What I know Azu's like half conscious, but mm. Yal Yali is like pr like probably catatonic and hysterical at the same time. I don't think they go leave unless someone literally physically pulls I, them. I think okay, away. I, we, I think Coral and Dechen literally just haul y'all onto my pig. You get a zoo, I'll get Yali. Okay. <laughs> And then yeah, they're like tr holding on to their we, stern dad's body and like trying to drag Mom. it out of the tunnel. Like this is horrifying. Like yeah, they're like Coral, trying to move. Yeah. You know, I think Coral p bends down and puts her hands on Yali's hands and like try to very gently remove them. And it's like we've got to go. Okay. I uh, I I I can't. This is my. Dad, these are my dads. This is our, our, this is our dad. I know. But we, we can't stay here. I can't, I, I can't, I, I, I can't leave him here. I, I can't leave. I never wanted them to, this isn't what I wanted. I think Coral just like, kind of does like a full body sob and then leans forward and just embraces Yali and just like the most like the biggest most intense hug <laughs> that they've ever um, given anyone and it I'm and like, it yeah go ahead go ahead and and she's she's like crying into Yali's like uh the the crook of the neck and it's just mm -hmm. like I know this is hard right now Yali but you're not alone anymore it's not just it's not just you. You have all of us, and we're going to find our other siblings, too, and it'll be okay. Uh, Yali is also, like, crying, I think, and, like, screaming hysterically uh, through all of this, uh, and like hands shaking and sobbing uh they like nod like very like rapidly like they can't control it uh and they just grab the mask i think that their stern dad was wearing right because he had a mask on right they yeah. grab it yeah and they like take the mask with them and Aww. they allow like coral to to leave with them oh my god the villain arc this is it oh That's i just absolutely thought oh on on razor wing i'm holding azu's like head in like my lap and just like i'm just oh. waiting we're both we're all covered in blood we're not okay and blood debris skeleton dust gore did, did that really happen or um yeah it happened uh, we have to go now fuck. and i go i i i don't even say mip mip i just i just tap razor wing and we we had we take off all right we are going to do an epilogue because who <laughs> i i need an ending that isn't going to make me feel like a pile of razor wing poop <laughs> yali villain uh, arc yali villain arc. <laughs> wait we all just one, become villains we just become a team one month of has passed one month one month okay you are all traveling together Give me I think, a snapshot oh. into what season two will look like. Well, I think we spent some time with my family because <laughs> we needed to go somewhere. We needed so, healing. We needed healing. Oh my God. Yeah. Maybe we just introduce Yali to each of our families and make them feel like yeah. they're yeah. part of There's each like, I don't have a families. family anymore. That's well, true. Well, no, why we're sharing ours with yours, with you. Yeah, you're part of our family, too. Uh -huh. There's, like, some comedic, like, snapshots of, like, family. it's, like, so some, com like, slightly, like, touching moments of, like, you know, we're in, like, a hot springs together, 
And then, you know, we go and we find, like, Coral's Justice Ma village. <laughs> <laughs> Where they're, like, we come as they're just chasing down someone for doing something awful. Okay, I'm right. just picturing something more wholesome. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, oh, dear. The entire village went... I was picturing we were out in a sailboat and there's like a snapshot where like Yali's caught in too big a fish, but they won't let go of it. And we're all like holding <laughs> on to them and the boat's about to tip over. <laughs> there's like an no, abandoned like over. tea set with like petit like a, 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 like a little like tea thing and it's like tipping over. <laughs> all the sandwiches oh. are falling into the sea. <laughs> yes. Dechen's like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Dechen's like like torn like she's like reaching out for the sandwich oh, she's reaching out for everybody else but she looks back at the sandwiches like this look of like no i made the sandwiches you would definitely get like a scene back um home with Azu and his older sister where we kind of like yeah. Azu excitedly telling like we just excitedly told the story about our like concert performance and we have we do like a little concert for her oh my god did jack freeze for anyone else jack did freeze. oh no there he goes. looks good for me Jack is here for me. Not visible. <gasps> what? Uh, she can't Drac see. Drac is back. here. Drac is here. I promise. Drac is here. Like, Drac will be back. Very, okay, you're back Drac's now. Drac. Drac. You're back. Ah! Yep. Back, Drac. I could. Can no. everyone not see me? For a no. minute. So the stream and I could not see you. <laughs> That's what I can't see. Vanna now. Uh oh. Has Vanna been a ghost this whole time? I can see Vanna. You can hear Vanna's me. That's me. all that matters. I can hear and see you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I can't see Vanna. Or can you Vanna. hear me? No. Oh, no. What a weird issue. I can, I can see Vanna and I can hear Vanna. So I don't know what's up with everybody else. Can I leave and come back really quick, Don? Okay. Yeah, that'd be me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. This is a drag Let me try problem. refreshing. <laughs> all right well like, i think the final scene um yali why don't you set the final scene yeah i think like we see these snapshots of like over the month going to like dechen's place the coral's place and finally azu's place putting on a show for like azu's you know big sister and like we see like uh yali looks happy you know in all of these you know obviously they look like they're sad, but like, they're like, oh, like with the fish and like, uh, so, you know, the tea and the performance. But then like we cut to like maybe after hours, you know, like at, at Azu's, ho like in Azu's hometown and everyone's mm -hmm. like winding down for the night and Yali's retreated to their quarters, right? Um, maybe being like, oh, it's okay, Dutch and I, I don't need a nightcap, I'm fine. You know, they like go back into- uh, <laughs> Dutch has got like a whole room. tray full of cookies and warm milk. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, I'm, oh. I'm good. Uh, thank you though, I appreciate it. Uh, they go back into their room and they close the door. Uh, and they, like, just, like, the, the smile on their face just sort of, like, like, slips off. Uh, and they go over to, like, the pouch on their bed. They, like, open up their, their sack and they pull out their father's mask. Uh, and they just sort of, like, and you just sort of see, like, the, the veins on the side of their neck, like, sort of, like, boil up, like, to, like, the sides of their face. And they, like, cover up their face, right? And they, like, open up the window, right? They put up a hood, you know, they, like, tighten a scarf over their mouth. And they, like, jump out the window for, like, some vigilante work that night. Yeah. Yes! Yeah! I'm fucking So good! <laughs> so good! I yes. want the comic, and I want it yesterday! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my goodness. I'm obsessed. Thank you. Y'all, thank you so much for playing this. Thank you, chat, for joining this episode, this finale of Avatar Legends, the RPG game. Yep, that's not redundant. This has been an absolute delight. Um, we have no endings left to go over because this is the end. I hope everybody learned how to play this game flawlessly. When you watch the RPG Exploration Society, you watch to learn how to play a game to the letter. You don't watch for the peak comedy. You don't watch for the star cast or our stellar performance. No, you're here for the rules. So with that being said, I hope everybody had a fantastic time. I have been your GM and host, B Zelda. You can find me on Twitter as at B underscore Zelda. I'm a podcaster, streamer, and community manager for D&D &D Adventures League. Oh my God, next RPGs. 
Exploration Society is Dark Souls. Dark Souls? Yeah, and I'm going to be in it. Ooh. You're going to die. Yeah, I'm yeah. Gonna I'm, I'm excited. Right <laughs> A thousand times over. Well, then, Drac, why don't you tell us where we can find you, support you, and when some Dark Souls is about to happen? Yeah, so uh, you can find me on Twitter at Draconix. That's D R A K O N I Q U E S. I'm kind of streaming all over the place, but uh, next thing I'm in is tomorrow at 4 p.m. Pacific, I believe, um, or 4.30 p.m. Pacific. I'm going to be over on Rule of Law. I'm going to be guessing on their um, um, Dragon Heist, Waterdeep Dragon Heist. Is that it? We mix the name up so much, I don't know what the real one is, but that one, the one at Waterdeep, <laughs> I'm going to be guessing that a campaign that they're running as Athanos, the ex-pirate. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, I'm going to be causing a lot of trouble for them. So if you want to check that out, please do. Um, on Wednesday at 6 p.m. Pacific, you can find me over at Rule of Law again in a, a side system campaign called Infinite Horizon, where I play time traveling lizard alien, who's the leader of a resistance force. So that's cool. Um, on Thursday at 3 p.m. Eastern, you can find me over Runaway Robot. Three, uh, I think it's at 3 p.m. Eastern already. In another D and another D and D campaign called Crimson Ruin, where we woke up in hell and we're trying to figure out why and trying to escape. Um, and yeah, that's everything. Just follow me on Twitter. I'll probably update you <laughs> to get all of that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, fabulous. Well, the ever foodie, forever sweet Michelle. Ah, oh, thank you so much. This was so much fun to play. I feel like I, I really, I've never, I've been an only child in my life, so I'm so excited to pretend that I have siblings. Um, I'm Aww. glad I got a taste of that. So thank you, everyone. Um, you can find me on Twitter at Kilnfeen Potter. Uh, again, where I tweet all about like games and Magic the Gathering and uh, baking and cooking and cats. Um, I also have a uh, Legos and Magic the Gathering lore stream on Thursday evenings at 9:30. 30 p.m. Uh, uh, 1933 p.m. Eastern. So that's 6 30 p.m. Uh, 6 30 p.m. Pacific and I believe 8 30 uh, Central, where it's really just me hanging out, you know, playing some music and building some Legos. Extremely chill. Life is hard. Aww. Come come hang out. <laughs> <laughs> and you can find me um, at twitch.tv slash kill and fodder. Fabulous. All right, moving on to our most chaotic of the bunch, filled with nothing but what's a synonym for chaos? Fanna, what is your middle name? Because I feel like that probably defines you to a T. <laughs> you want my social security number to be? <laughs> Uh, what's your <laughs> can I get your mother's name? maiden name and the street you were living on when you were five? I was trying to decide if you were gonna call on me or Connie. <laughs> ah, I Connie's think... controlled chaos. You're like oh, I'm, a, I'm a Leo, chaos. so <laughs> I'm an Aries. We're both fire signs. Makes sense. Makes sense. My this sister is Gemini, so it's an oh, Aries. <laughs> um, were you calling on me then? Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm Vanna. I'm not going to tell you my middle name. <laughs> and um, uh, you can find me streaming full time at twitch.tv slash Vanna. That is V A N A. And you find me on most social medias at Havana Rama, H A V A N A R A M A. Um, and I have nothing going on except being yeah. mentally ill. <laughs> Great streams. Thanks. I'm playing Zelda Breath of the Wild right now, so it's very fun. <gasps> yeah. yeah. That's an awesome game. We're doing the sword trials in the DLC right now, and they are hard. <laughs> Ooh, I stopped at those. <laughs> I did the first chunk first try, but I imagine the next chunk, I, I, it will not be like that. It'll be more ragey. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Good luck. Thanks. I wish you well. Thank you. <laughs> and finally, the traumatized son that we all never wanted but love with all of our hearts. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> I don't want a traumatized son. I want a lovely, healthy son. One just final been... knife under the rib here. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I've been Connie playing Yali, who is try. I, I never imagined their arc to end this way, but being Neither did I. this way. <laughs> at all. I um, love this. Best. Here we are. 
<laughs> oh my god yeah uh, i'm connie my pronouns are they he and she you could find me on twitter tiktok and ko-fi at by connie chong that's b-y c-o-n-n-i-e-c-h-a-n-g uh i am the gm and creative producer for trans planar rpg uh which is an all transgender people of color led 100 percent homebrew DD show set in andake a non-colonial anti-orientalist world we are a grim dark gritty fantasy campaign that deals with some heavy topics so if you like all that stuff um but a hundred percent more i think uh dark gritty uh queer trans feelings and chaos and emotional bullshit uh tune in saturdays at 7 p.m u.s central time 8 p.m eastern 5 p.m pacific and we also have a backlog on our podcast where you can just search transplaner rpg wherever you pod your casts uh so check us out transplaner rpg and myself out at by connie chong i'm gonna shoot the uh shit back to b <laughs> Keep your shit. Fine, I'll take it. All right, everyone, catch up on all of our shows on YouTube or as podcasts. Remember to like, comment, or subscribe and ring that bell to be notified when new content is posted on the channel. Join the Exploration Society on Ko-Fi and give our Discord a join so we can talk shop all day long, including a thread just for this episode. The That is everything I want to read. See you next time. Join us Sunday for our over... Arms actual play do Pantheon Academia with GM Stephen Pope. Thank you, everybody, and take care. Bye.